Hello? Hello? What's going on, guys? Ah, hello out there. What's going on? What's going on? First to like and stream says no views. Always appreciate you guys hitting that like button. Who was first today? Apollo X was first yet again. Yet again, Apollo X. Cracked <laughs> me up. I saw you do that the first time. I thought it was frozen. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I never know how to start the live streams, man. So I don't know. I just... <laughs> I don't even know what I'm doing. When does Marvel's Capcom Infinite come out? I have no clue. We all beat Dachi, we're all winners. <laughs> yeah. What's going on, guys? Anybody grinding out the Crystal Cornucopia? Because that's what I'm going to be doing tonight. Got to get those four star shards. Hi, hey, Brian Brazil here. What is up, Brazil? Brian, I got a four-star Hawkeye. I don't know if he's good. Some people like him. Some don't. You're going to have to uh, test him out yourself. Personally, I'm not a big fan of him. But I know uh, Dorky Diggity Dave is a huge fan of Hawkeye. Hey, Brian, when you get a chance, can you check out my profile? See how I'm doing for playing nine months? Sorry, dude. Can't check out profiles, otherwise that's all I'll be doing all night is checking out different profiles. It's buffering a lot and you're super fuzzy, usually never happens. Strange. It's uh everything's normal on my end here. Just got a three star quake? Nice. Got Doctor Strange from a premium crystal? Dude, that's incredible. Got four star Magneto, is he a good one? Uh, Magneto has his uses. One of the best things about him is that he's on one of like the, the strongest synergy teams known to man. So, uh, not a bad pull by any means. I don't like using him a whole lot myself, but he definitely has his uses. Definitely has his uses. <laughs> Could you be my dad? Um, that's pr um, I don't. I'm not, I'm not too familiar with with science. Is that? Can that happen? Son, is, is that you? <laughs> what are Doctor Strange's uses? Uh, Yeet said he is overrated. I doubt Yeet would say that. If he did say that, then I don't even know what to say, because Doctor Strange is used for everything. Or useful for everything, at least. Alright. Um... We've got to uh, hit up the Twitter, guys. We've got to hit up the Twitter. Nice amount of units. Thank you. Uh, I'm tempted to spend some of those. Is that sale over on the potions? Let me check that out real quick. Potion sale is not over yet. I'm tempted to uh, pick up a couple of these, though. I already bought a bunch. I stocked up a bit. Uh, I don't want to go overboard, but now, yeah, now I'm thinking about buying some more. I'm not sure what to do. I might buy some more. We'll see. I got I got a little bit of time still. Got a little bit of time still. Scarlet Witch or Cable duped? Uh, I mean, Scarlet Witch duped is, is pretty much numero uno. Um, if you need prestige, though, then forget about Scarlet Witch because she's not so good in the prestige department. Uh, okay, yeah, yeah, Twitter. What am I doing? What am I doing? Twitter. Uh, does anybody have any kind of uh, tweets that you want me to send out? I'm not sure what to say tonight, guys. Don't have any any of us see tweets planned. Uh, let me get this all set up. All right. Is it efficient to do expert daily uh, quest if I can't do the hardest path? I mean, it's never efficient if you if you can't do the hardest path, but sometimes you got to do what you got to do. Um, when I first started out in the game, uh, the, the, the daily catalyst events, I was doing just the easy path every day, and that was it. Do what you got to do.
Congrats on the quick and Miles Morales today. Thank you. Uh, happy about both of those for sure. Are these early streams permanent now? No. Uh, just on the weekends. Just on the weekends I can do them. Um, during the week, it's it's still going to be 1.30 a.m. starting. It's That's the earliest I can start them. No choice around that. What, what team did you use for Labyrinth of Legends? I didn't beat Labyrinth of Legends yet. Um, I'm still trying to get the right champion and, and uh, save up units. Um, all right, too many questions, not enough Twittering. Let's uh, let's get a tweet out there, guys, so that I can get actually start playing the game. Uh, deer at Marvel Champions. <laughs> I don't know what I was doing just then. Um. <laughs> <laughs> because I was making some like weird throat noising or throat uh, clearing noise I just thought of this one should I tell them this dear Marvel champions turn your head and cough <laughs> uh, probably not probably not right a little, little too awkward there Kind of, kind of sounded like he started a car. Just a bit cringy, yeah. <laughs> Give us more free stuff? No way, man. I'm tired of the free stuff. I want stuff to do in the game to get the stuff. Like Dimensional Rifts, which are coming in like three days, guys. Who is hyped about Dimensional Rifts? If I get if I get a science awakening gem for the dim dimensional rifts, uh, yeah, Quake is going rank five. Like I'm not even gonna think twice about it. I'll probably think twice about it, but pretty sure it's gonna be Quake rank five. Should I ask him about drop rates? Should I be like? Uh, what are the chances to pull a four star from a four star crystal? You guys aren't giving me any tweets. You guys aren't feeding me any tweets. So I gotta. I'm just gonna go with this. Uh, P is I am now live. Glad I'm early tonight. Long day with the family. I need a live stream to keep me up while grinding. Let's do it, Steiny. I gotta do some grinding myself. Um, yeah, let's just send this out. Brian, I'm back. Had a hectic past few days. Dicer, what's up, man? Uh, I think you were in the doghouse last night. Didn't get any units. That's all right. Now that you're here, we're probably going to pull some units tonight. So it's going gonna, it's gonna to be all good. All right. Um, let's get to it, guys. Let's get to it. Uh, I'm a little bit behind in the arena. I feel like I say that every single arena. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm, I only have 636,000, guys. Uh, to get the four-star shards... <laughs> first, <laughs> a little bit late. <laughs> um, to get the four-star shards, you need a little bit over 2 million. I don't know exactly how much over 2 million. I've heard some things. I've heard 2.1, 2.2, 2.3... Somewhere in that ballpark, right? Um, but I don't, I don't like to, I don't like to, I don't like to just barely get there. If I'm going for four star shards, you know, I want to get the four star shards. So, yeah, let's go for like two point six. <laughs> um, let's just get to it. Cause yeah, I, I gotta rebuild the stash, guys. Gotta rebuild that stash. Uh, super happy about today's opening, but I want more, guys. The greed. I hate fighting uh, Magneto with Cable here. Got that immunity. Look at that, or not immunity, uh, magnetism. Couldn't even get my uh, my degeneration on him. Lame. I'm just gonna watch ads. No. <laughs> What's going on, Drop Faith? Dude, you must have pulled uh, you must have pulled Iron Man, didn't you, Drop Faith? 
I thought about you as soon as I saw the uh, the cutoffs. Somebody in my alliance got like just over seven million and got like four hundred and forty or something like that. And I was like, ooh, drop faith got a Iron Man. <laughs> you actually play this arena? Uh, yeah, not every week. You open a premium and got Loki? What? Well, all right then. How active is your alliance? My alliance is super active. It doesn't really get more active than my alliance. I mean, it, it, it does, right? We're not like the most active in the entire world, but uh, we're up there, man. We're probably in like the... Just in terms of activity, we're up there in like the top 10. Um, in terms of like how high rated we are and stuff like that, we're not even close. Uh, and how like, you know, like our alliance war rating and stuff like that, we're not even close, but... Uh, we're a very active bunch. <laughs> My day went Brian stream YouTube, two hours of sleep, seat and stream, Minecraft, other games like MCOC, more YouTube and YouTube. Uh, about to go to sleep, keep watching YouTube. About to go to sleep. See this. That's a lot of YouTube, man. <laughs> I can't say, uh, I, mean, I, I can't lie and say I've never, never spent that much time on YouTube before, but yeah, that's a lot. <laughs> yeah, have a good one, man. I understand. How much do you need for 100 shards? I don't know. Uh, I only know the 500 shard one. Wait, did I say 100? I, if I did, I meant to say 1,000. Uh, 1,000 shards, yeah. What's cool, guys, is uh, after that 4-star opening today, I actually got enough 5-star shards to do a 5-star opening. And I don't know what to do with them. I'm going to hold on to them for a little bit. Um, I'm going to see what happens with the dimensional rifts and all that stuff. Um, I'm super tempted to hold them until Guardians of the Galaxy, just in case there is a new rocket coming out. I have a feeling that's like, I mean, they, they haven't added any Guardians of the Galaxy characters in a long time as far as I know, right? Well, I guess, I guess people said Howard the Duck was in that movie. Tristan the Champion, what's going on? Uh, I guess people said Howard the Duck is in Guardians of the Galaxy, but yeah, I guess like one of the, is there, is there any other like core members of, of that series that's not in the game yet? Because I really, I, I honestly have no clue. Um... But it would just be really cool if they added a new rocket. Passed out earlier and woke up panicking I wouldn't get Loki. Wanted to do two more runs, but got him thankfully. Nice. So his... I was actually right for once, or close to it, for Loki's cutoff. Um, it looks like it was right about, like, what, 5.1 million or something like that? They're going to edit Gamora. Yandu, everyone's saying Yandu. Yeah, I've never even heard of Yandu, but uh, if sounds like um, like if all of you are saying Yandu at the same time, um, then I'm guessing that is something that they would actually add. How it was just in a 10-second scene post credits. Uh, okay. Rabbit Rocket Raccoon Halloween event? Yeah, man, I'm hoping for that to happen. Like, I'm going to bug the crap out of them about that uh, come Comic-Con. But unfortunately, yeah, Comic-Con is like right around Halloween time, so it'll be too late. But maybe they could squeeze that in like next year or something, I don't know. Brian, why do you hate me? Uh, I'm just not a big fan of x -Pool Dead Force, man. <laughs> um, boring champion, kind of. Love Rocket's gonna be my first rank 5? Yeah, nice. Uh, I wish I had the catalyst to take Rocket up. I got too many other champions that I gotta do first, though. Winter Dimensional Rifts in like three days, man. Three 
days. Like I'm tempted. I was tempted just to, to like rush through uh, Master today and like have the shards ready to go on day one. But yeah, I'm probably not gonna do that. Brian, I love you. Please reply. I love you too, man. I love you too, Rob Christian. Yandu and Nebula. All right, so there's another name out there. N another name that I don't know. Managed to dupe uh, Sig 60 rocket to 550. Man, yeah, I definitely, definitely do want a rocket dupe. Hey, points. Uh, you going to score, bro? Frojo, what's going on? Um, I, um, I'm going to go for like 2.6 million. I'm going to play it a little bit safe. 2.6 million should be very safe, right? Count is only 85k rating, and I'm hyped for Dimensional Rifts. Dimensional Rifts were back then. I was bad, and now I'm not so bad. Dude, it's going to be amazing. Uh, or, I mean, I don't want to overhype it just in case you get unlucky or something, because it's possible to get unlucky, right? But the chances of something amazing happening to you are, are pretty high. You have one chapter left in Beginner, and you're 100% all of them? Dude, nice. Yeah, I'm 100% I'm with Normal and Heroic. I didn't touch the other two yet. This guy watching Walking Dead and saw you're on. Frojo, man. Um, my Prestige, I don't know if you if you caught my opening today. Uh, but my Prestige could, by the end of the month, go up to 4,300, technically. Uh, it's probably not going to... I I don't know what to do. Um, so I got, I got Quake, basically. For those of you who haven't seen it, sorry I'm spoiling it, but I got Quake. I'm not going to say all the champions, but I got Quake. Uh, I only got Quake one time. I have to awaken her. Um, but I have enough signature stones to uh, take her all the way up. Maybe not to 99. I might have enough to take her to 99, but if not 99, then it'll be like pretty high at least. I'm talking like 80 or something like that. Um, and then if I got Dormammu, and he has high prestige, and I ranked him up... Uh, that would be like 4,300 prestige, even with uh, Black Widow being in my top five. So, yeah, with Black Widow and Ultron being in the top five. Killa, what's going on, man? Long time, glad to be back. Yeah, man, it's good to have you here. Uh, we never did that talk that we were going to do. The, the super secret talk. <laughs> we got to do that still one of these days. Watched it almost immediately. Dice. So yeah, I, I was tempted to use my, my Generic Awakening Gem on, on Quake, but of course I'm going to wait for the Dimensional Rift since they're right around the corner. Um, and the thing is, like, I know Quake is coming up in Arena in April, but that's too far away. Like, I feel like if we make a push for Prestige, we can get... I feel like we can get Tier 4 Class Catalyst before April. Um, maybe not much before it, right? But uh, I feel like it's doable. You see Brona Noob's uh, video on his five-star uh, Iron Fist demolishing Master Ramu. Uh, I didn't. I, I heard of it. People said he did it in like 12 hits or something like that. Um, I wish I had that champion, man. Last video, haven't heard anything if you're talking to me since you said quick. Okay. Uh, Alright, I'll just say it again. Um, so yeah, I was t I'm tempted to use my Generic Awakening Gem on Quake. She comes around... Like, I'm going to wait until after Dimension Rifts, because if I get a Science Awakening Gem, then uh, I'm just going to go with the Science Awakening Gem, of course. Um, she comes around as the basic champion in April, but I think we can get Tier 4 Class Catalyst before then, so that's why I'm tempted to uh, break out the Generic Awakening. Brian, so how is Reflector 2? Is it uh, what you're using now? Um, no, actually, I, uh, I'm still on Air Server. Um, I really should have set it up tonight. I had like a good 45 minutes that were free uh, right before stream. I probably could have done it. Did you ever get yours working? Is Quake good unduped? Um, I feel like she needs to be duped to be good on her own, but her, uh, her synergy is good on dupes, of course, so yeah. Or it has, at least it sounds like it has some potential good uses. 
<laughs> Let's be honest, you haven't used the 10k basic ISO yet. You'll never use the generic gem. Um, that's possible, but... I don't know. I feel like the, the four-star gems, I feel like... While they'll never be common, I feel like they're going to become a little bit more common. Um, Soon-ish. Like, maybe with Act 5, maybe they'll, maybe they'll throw one out there for... Uh, like the single clear or something like that. As long as I'm sitting on like one extra one, I'll, I'm, I'm okay. Didn't get yours working? I go towards air server? Bummer, dude. Um, I don't I don't think that's the problem. I think the problem you were having was just, just OBS, maybe. Yeah, I'm not really sure what to... Uh, how to help you with that one. Ryan, please reply to me. It's my birthday today. Wait, I just replied to you before. <laughs> Rob Christian. But still, bad. Happy birthday. Take you 550 to, uh, quick, quick to 550 immediately after scoring an Awakening Gem from Dimension Rifts. Uh, sadly, she's uh, only 67, though. Still, man. How do you like her? Do you, like, do you play with her, or was it more just like a prestige thing for you? That's a good idea, new plays. Uh, if you go to like the OBS forums or something like that, uh, maybe they'll be able to help you out. Brian, going one to five percent uh, first time. What's the safe score? Uh, well, I'll tell you what the cutoff is. You can decide what your own safe score is, like or, or approximately what the cutoff is going to be. Uh, the cutoff is somewhere between like two point one and like two point three, maybe even two point four million, something like that. Um, of course, it, it, it fluctuates. Um, so, what you want to go, like, if you want to go above that to be safe, it's up to you how far above you want to go. I'm going to 2.6, which I think is going to be safe, but uh, I mean, technically, I, I could miss out myself. Um, but it's only, it's only four star shards. It's not like I'm missing out on a whole champion, so uh, I'm not going to stress it too much. But the Iron, uh, wait, what, what is this? But the Iron Man bundle again, five four-star Iron Patriots. I'm so happy because they're already at 550 unduped, best champion 2017. Somehow, I feel like you just might be trolling. <laughs> hey, Baldy Sub, did you know that 95% of humans have hair? I have hair. It's just, you know. Not up there, really. I don't have too many champs. How do I grind arena? Well, arena is where you get the champs. Level up your two stars. Go in the two star arena. Pick up those three star champions. Start leveling up the three star champions. It's going to take a while. It took me a while, but uh, yeah. What are you referring to when you say day one or day four? What does that mean? Uh. Not sure exactly what you mean. Um, day one or day four? Day one or day four? Oh, are you talking about Alliance Quest, possibly? Alliance Quest, uh, day one. There's five days of Alliance Quest. Um, and on day one, it's the easiest. And then you gain uh, prestige throughout the course of it. And it just becomes harder and harder. I'm with 20 Mordo. Uh, Ghost Rider Crystals, all two stars. Bomber, dude. Feel like you're periodically playing with one hand? Uh, yeah, sometimes I switch to two hands. Mainly for prestige, but I throw in a line sport defense, but slowly learning how to use her offensively. She's growing on me. I would probably do the same. Um, I, I want to learn about Quake a lot more. Like I, I really do want to uh, test her out. I mean, I say that for all the champions, of course, right? Um, but yeah, I would probably stick her on Alliance sport defense with some other combinations. Uh, and see how that went. Ooh, I wonder if she works with Cable, because Cable's now on uh, defense as well. So, Quake plus Cable, does that increase his uh, chances to regen and stuff like that? Has 
hashtag love me Brian. I know you want to say it, Brian. Just do it. I know you want to. I said it, man. Just for you. Guys, I'm glad I didn't get an Iron Patriot today. Like, I, I said I wanted him in my video, right? Um, but I more of just wanted him just, just to put a tech champion on screen, you know? Um, I'm, I'm fine with not pulling a four-star Iron Patriot. Like, eventually I want to get him. Maybe he'll come around in Arena on, like, uh, 4th of July or something like that. I don't know. I was watching you this morning, saw uh, Spider-Man Symbiote on your channel, and got a three-star Spider-Man for my crystal. Nice. My thing, is she better on offense or defense, Brian? I, I don't know yet. Literally just got her. So, yeah, I don't know. Um, she Her abilities are not terribly difficult to dodge, um, but occasionally... Just because she's a little bit different than the average champion, occasionally you get tripped up by them. But for the most part, I have no problem dodging her abilities and stuff like that. Um, had to run a Walmart pay for me. Um, her, her, I have to look at her block proficiency again because I know she has high block proficiency if she's awakened. Um, I don't know how it compares to like the Captain Americas and stuff like that. Right, we'll be going for Dumamu Arena. Yes, going for Dumamu two times. It's going to be insane. Don't know if I will get Dumamu at all, let alone twice. Uh, but I'm going to try, man. I'm going to give it my all. Doctor Strange is amazing. Doctor Strange is amazing. I'm sure I do Act 4 or Realm of Legends. Um, I think that um, Chapters 1 and 2 of Act 4 are easier than Realm of Legends, and Chapters 3 and 4 are more difficult than Realm of Legends. Kevin C, I already answered you about day one or day four. Uh, that is the uh, five day cycle of Alliance quests. <laughs> Be back next stream, Brian. Swear on my life. Uh, Swear on your life. Oh, jeez, man. I will make Love Me Brian a trend. Mark my words. All right, dude. Is Spider-Man Symbio good? Yeah, he's good. Uh, his damage is really high. Um, I was messing around with him a little bit before stream, actually. Uh, even at rank 3, is he, he can do some damage. Twenty million to Mama minimum easily. I don't know if he's gonna go twenty million. He might. Um, like I wouldn't be shocked. Um, but I'm hoping it's not that high. Twenty million is a lot. Don't use your three. Thank you. Doc, AV, Vision, or five star Moon Knight to rank four or two for Moon Knight. All unduped. Uh, Doc, for sure. Not even, uh... I would go with all three of those four stars, actually. They're all, all three of them are decent unduped. Uh, in that order, Doc, AV, then Vision. Uh, I wouldn't, I wouldn't touch Moon Knight. You can take him to level 25, but, uh, using the tier 4 catalyst on him, um, probably not worth it yet. Probably not worth it yet. You're better off leveling up those four star champions. See, it's funny. It's like a truck doesn't need to be duped to be good either. That's right. He does not need to be duped. Um, of course, I wanted those silver stars for him, but uh, yeah, his his duped ability is eh, it's nothing too crazy. It can trip you up every once in a while if you're like backed into a corner and you can't wait for the debuff to go off if you're fighting against him. Um, but other than that, he's fine unduped. Ryan, you seriously never got Wolverine? Uh, not yet. I have the three-star version of him, but that's about it. Are the arena points higher since it's four and five-star arena, like per fight? 
Um, the points, yeah, you get you get more points. Like the the five five star champions give a ton of points. Um, I wish I had more of them. I wish I had them ranked up because they give an absolute ton. <laughs> the more people that say hashtag love me, Brian, more points to get it in the arena and get your mamu. Does it work like that? That'd be nice. <laughs> Friday got five premiums, you know what that means? Ask what? I don't know, I was asking you. Wow. What are you going for in Arena? Uh, I'm going to try to get to about 2.6 million. I feel very comfortable and safe at 2.6 million. Just gotta say this, what you've achieved in this game without the use of any money is really amazing. Following your footsteps, bro. Nice. Good luck, man. It's definitely doable. Absolutely doable. Uh, I played the first, like, six or seven months of this game super casually. Um, didn't even open a four-star crystal or anything like that. So it is doable. Of course, now I play a lot, though. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, I play a lot, a lot. Right, which member of the spider family do you like the most? Uh, I like Miles, but I find it harder to parry with him because he always wants to evade. Um, which member of the spider family? So we're talking about um, Spider-Man, Symbiote, Miles Morales, and Spider-Gwen, I guess we're throwing in there as well. Um, it's... I like playing as, as Symbiote Spider-Man the most. Um, who I like most overall is probably Miles Morales. Meanwhile, I'm going to dump money into getting Archangel if he's good. I don't even, I don't even know anything about Archangel. I, I thought it was a girl, actually. I don't know why I thought Archangel was a female character. But it's not, right? It's... Like, I saw a screenshot or whatever. Uh, I didn't even... I did not even realize I was fighting uh, Unstoppable Juggernaut over here. Age of Venom is part of the, part of the uh, spider family, too. Uh, I, I mean, I yeah. I don't know much about the lore, so I, I just count those four. I don't count the uh, the Venoms and stuff like that, I guess. Guys, I have a Cosmic Awakening gem. Uh, should I awaken Symbiote Spidey, Venom, or save for Thor? I would save it. I would save it. You don't need Symbiote Spidey uh, awakened. Um, not really sure. I don't. I can't remember what Venom's awakened ability does, but um, yeah, he's not really a memorable character for me. So I would save it. Fantini, what's up, man? Oh, he's from Spidey's High School. Okay. Uh, if you do Realm of Legends, Winter Soldier, beat him and get the heals and exit. Uh, you get the heals, but if you repeat that, you still get... Um Heals if you beat him once already. Yeah, you can repeat it over and over and over if you want. Uh, you could literally max out your healing and then keep going back to max out your, your stash or whatever. Which you can't really max out your stash, but yeah, you know what I mean. You can you can farm him as much as you want. It used to be even better when he gave out revives. Uh, it's, it's not as good now. Still good. Get those potions, but yeah, the revives, I miss those. I would have got. I would have farmed up like 150 of those before I did uh, uh, Road to the Labyrinth. Technically, I guess I, I spent a lot of units on the potions. Maybe I should have done that for potions still. New subscriber, welcome. Brian, good luck in this arena. You grind, are you doing it as well? But I'm at 490k at the moment. Nice, man. Hey, as long as you're doing it, even if you don't get the uh, the top rewards or anything like that, it's it's good. 
Um, I wasn't sure what I was going to do with this arena today. I didn't, I didn't know if I was just going to get the uh, the milestones or if I was going to go for the four star shards. But I missed the four star shards, so I'm going to try to get them. Right, I'm almost done with recording chapter three of Heroic Quest. Nice. Right, I just duped my classic Daredevil. Nice. Um, should I rank for him or Agent Venom? Uh, uh, that's a tough one, man. Both good champions. Both good champions. Um, that actually is really tough, man. Uh, I, I guess I would probably go with Daredevil. Yeah, I would go with Daredevil. But the, honestly, they're both good. So if you want to like test out both of them and, and see how they are and stuff like that, uh, and if you prefer one over the other, then, then just go with that one. Do you think Dormammu will take over your profile? I, I'm hoping... I'm hoping that Dormammu takes over my profile, yeah. I'm hoping Dormammu's prestige is like 5 million. I was going to say 5,000, but not even. I want it to be 5 million. Um, I'm hoping it's, it's crazy. on Quake, thank you. Red Hulk sucks? Eh, I mean, Red Hulk's alright. I don't think he's that bad, to be honest. I have fun playing with him. Uh, he's not my favorite champion, but I don't think he's that bad either. Two days ago, I duplicated Rocket Raccoon and, and took him to rank 4. He took over my profile. Nice, man. I want that Rocket Raccoon dupe so bad. They messed up by Electra. What else is new? Brian, I finally hit 4,100 my prestige. Nice. Actually, guys, in my in my video, I said uh, you know Red Hulk isn't a prestige champion for me, but technically Red Hulk is in my top five now. Uh, I gained like 13 prestige or something like that, uh, even though Red Hulk is um, rank four still. So, yay, 13 prestige. We're going to go up half a point on average for my alliance. Is the Conflicted Crystal worth wasting 1,500 units on to try to get Hood or Cable? Um, are they worth it unduped? Uh, I don't think it's... I mean, I don't think it's worth it, but that's your money or your units... You know, do what you want with them. Um, are they good unduped? Uh, Hood is good unduped. Hood is good unduped. Um, cable probably needs to be duped, I want to say. Um, I mean, technically, you could argue like no champion needs to be duped, right? But uh, I feel like he needs to be duped. That power gain. Red Oak is one of the champs that I want to love more and more every time I use him, but never gives me a reason to. Uh, I, I, I actually like him. Like. Uh, He's a tank who can actually do some okay damage. Like, the extra damage that he does on every attack um, is, is pretty nice. Like, it's not that bad. Uh, because it's like a percentage of, of your damage. So when you do a special, like, it's just it's just adding more damage on top of it. Uh, and magic damage at that. So, I like him. I do like him. Guys, I gotta level up more 4-star champions. <laughs> We're gonna have to do some uh, some preparations before uh, the Dormammu arena. If I could level up some more four star champions, have an extra team of four stars. Um, technically, I'll have two extra teams since I uh, was grinding for Hood, so it's actually not that bad. I'll I'll be close to nine hundred thousand per round. I don't think I'll be at nine hundred thousand. I think I'll be at like uh, eight hundred and ninety thousand per round or something like that. But I'm getting there. I 
mean, how likely is it to get a four star awakening gem? Is it a pretty good chance, or is it really rare? You're talking about in the dimensional rifts, it's a pretty good chance to get an awakening gem, uh, but they're class specific awakening gems, so uh, it's still rare to get the one that you want. Early stream tonight? Yep, early stream. Um, Got to get an early one on the on the weekends, you know. What do you think about Black Suit Spidey? Uh, we were just talking about Black Suit Spidey, actually. Um, I like Black Suit Spidey. He's probably my favorite of the spider characters for me to uh, actually play with. His damage, like he he hits like a truck. He hits like he hits like an absolute truck. Um, we don't have to spend all night in arena tonight, so like. I can show you some of the damage that he can dish out as, as just a three-star champion. Uh, so I think this, is this my last round or do I have one more round to go in here? Hang on, let me, let me check this out. Ryan, your advice helped me out. I'm a little over 800k per round. Dude, nice. Um, oh no, I have more champions. They're refreshing, I think. Yeah. Let me check this out real quick. Oh, uh, yeah, that's what it is. I do have more champions. They're just starting to refresh. Okay. Um, yeah, I was doing this arena a little bit before I started up the stream. Got the worst possible rewards in every single Rift did last time. We did a lot. Bummer, dude. Hopefully, uh, hopefully it balances out this time and you got, like, the sickest Rifts ever. It's Monday over there for you? Yeah. Stupid worldwide time and spinning around the sun and all that stuff. It'd be so much easier if everybody was just on the same time, right? The sun was out every, you know, the same same time of day for us. Has Kabam announced any other ways to get dimensional shards besides the quest or the login calendar? Uh, no, I don't think so. And I don't know if there is going to be another way. Um, if I had to guess, if I had to guess, I don't think there's another way other than maybe they'll have another offer like they did last time, where it was like a four-tier offer where you can like buy some shards and stuff like that to complete a rift. Um, but even that, I don't know if they'll do because last time that helped out people who like did some solo quests but didn't have enough to complete rifts for them or something like that. Um, this time, like you. You get the shards from doing the quest, and it's up to you if you want to get them or not. But Brian, Iron Fist series on Netflix? Question uh, mark. Yeah, I don't know anything about the Iron Fist series um, on Netflix. I don't even have Netflix, and even if I did, to be completely honest, I I wouldn't be watching it. <laughs> The wrist will be available in, in a couple of days, three days. Yeah, everyone's saying uh, the 15th. Will Dramamo be your favorite Mystic character? I don't know. Uh, I can't really answer that without actually playing the character. Um, Hood is pretty fun to play. I have him at rank 3 now since there was a Mystic uh, level up event going on. Are there shards in the pop-up buffers when you beat a tier of monthly? I don't think so. Show a symbiote. I'll, I'll, yeah, I'll show you in, in a little bit here. Uh, let me let me actually finish up this round of arena first, though. Early today. Yep. Sundays got to be a little bit early on the Sundays. Or just the weekends in general. BG, you want to try and expand your Marvel knowledge since you love the game so much? Well, I mean, every day I kind of learn something new about Marvel just by streaming and you guys tell me about, like, the Marvel Universe and everything. Um, but, yeah, I just, I don't know. I can't get into those kind of shows is the thing. Um... I don't know, I'm just not into it. Like, I, I really like this game. One of my favorite games of all time. 
uh, play the crap out of it, but I don't love it because it's Marvel related. I love it just because it's a, it's a good game. So yeah. Mordo or Gwenpool? Gwenpool all the way. I hate Mordo. Mordo's such a boring champion, man. He's really good on defense and stuff like that. His prestige is through the roof. Highest highest prestige four-star champion in the game. Um, but other than that, I don't like him. Did you see Doctor Strange? I did see Doctor Strange. That is like the last Marvel-related thing that I saw. Um... And it was, it was hard for me to get into it, to be honest. Uh, I don't want to say it was like a bad movie or something like that. Everybody else loved it. Everyone I know loves the movie. Um, but I, I just couldn't get into it. Uh, I couldn't get into... I, I, it's hard for me to get into movies when the main character is like arrogant like that. Um, and yeah, I don't know. Like I, I, just, I lose my train of thought like while watching the movie. And I'll just like totally mentally phase out and start thinking about other stuff that I'd rather be doing while watching the movie. Uh, and I'll just come back like 10 minutes later like, wait, what, what's going on now? <laughs> like, I don't know. You have an arena addiction? It's the rewards, man. The rewards are so good. Like, I, I gotta keep going. Everybody's asking for better rewards in arena. And I'm like, uh, okay, sure. You guys ask for that. Meanwhile, I'm gonna play arena and or get the amazing rewards that already exist. No problem. Superior Iron Man or Grimora? Uh, I gotta go with Superior Iron Man. Um, Superior Iron Man has the uh, the synergies that I like. Neither of them are spectacular standalone characters, but uh, yeah, Superior Iron Man has those synergies. In your honest opinion, Mordo or Civil War Black Panther? Neither champion is like super fun. They're both just really good defensive champions. Um, so in that case, I would go Mordo. You're an interesting dude. Yeah, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> Brian, are you going to see Infinity War? Eh, probably not. <laughs> probably not, to be honest. Brian, you don't like Doctor Strange because he reminds you of yourself? Arrogant? Really? Do I come off as arrogant? Alright, yeah, that is it for my rounds of arena here. We've got an hour and 15 minutes. That's a lot longer than my normal uh, downtime for arena. Um, I do have to hit up the, the three-star arena, or the crystal splash arena as well. Um, I'm going to get those milestones, but we'll take a little bit of arena break. Um, going to, uh, let's, let's do this, guys. Well, first off, what do we got going on here? Aha, that's right, arena wins. Oh, man. There's mutant advancement going on. I would love to take advantage of that. But, um, whoops, did not mean to go back into that. Uh, so, yeah, you guys probably saw my opening today. I'm sure a lot of you here saw it, at least. If you did not, uh, I picked up this, this storm here at the bottom left of the screen. Um, picked up storm, and I would love to level up storm. Um, but fade up the catalysts. It's just not meant to be. I don't have the uh, the tier two catalyst needed. I'm like one and uh, like technically there's a way that I could get the catalyst needed, but I'm not gonna do it. Uh, I'm not gonna spend energy refills um, getting uh, or going through like the Sunday event and stuff like that. Um. See. Yeah, let's go back to uh, Rumble Legends Winter Soul Challenge. Yeah, that's that's what I was planning on doing. I was just trying to think about some other stuff. Um, you know, let me let me hit up Alliance Quest real quick, just in case I'm like holding us up here. All right, I didn't think so. Um, one, two, three, four, five. All right, so I need five energy to clear out my my lane here, so I'm good for a while. Uh, we'll step back in here when I get like an extra energy, so I can actually take out a node. All right, so, uh, Realm of Legends, let's do it. Now, my symbiote Spider-Man, he's, he's only, he's only rank three, guys, so he's not going to be hitting, uh, as hard as I'm describing that he hits, right? Like, he's only rank three. Um, 
actually I'll show you guys real quick just to just in case you're like what but he has a, such a high rating and stuff like that that's just because I run suicide masteries but he's, he's actually only ranked three um, good damage for rank three though 1237 is pretty high all right let's let's do this um, so the thing about symbiote spider-man if you guys are unaware oh, actually let me go back into his info here the thing about symbiote spider-man if you guys are unaware his heavy attack 100% chance to armor break, removing enemy armor and applying 8% armor reduction for 80 seconds. Now, 8% is not a lot. It, it's not a lot, right? But because it lasts for 80 seconds, you can stack this up like crazy. You can get over 10 stacks relatively easy. Um, Ryan, crit damage team, this is a crit damage team. It's not like full crit damage. Technically, I could probably eke out a little bit more, but... Uh, for the most part, it's 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 crit damage. There's like 75% or something like that, or 70%, I think. Uh, if I could replace this uh, three-star Superior Iron Man with a five-star, then it'll be 75. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna I'm just gonna do this fight one time. I'm not even gonna do the whole fight. It would take too long to do the whole fight. Still, uh, <laughs> survived Walmart. Nice, Frojo. Uh, it would take too long to do the whole fight with a rank three. If he was rank 5 or something like that, I would just do it because it wouldn't take that long. Um, but I'll give you guys a little demonstration of how you can stack this up. So we got 3 going right now. And just keep your eyes on the numbers, guys. They're, they're going to be growing. That was like a 2400 crit, I think. Oh, whoops. I thought I had it there. Alright, so we're up to a 7 stack. Make that 8. Uh, and his level 2 special it does, it's like an auto crit. Um, but I'm not going to use level 2 special right now. I want to see how high I can get this first. I wish there was a way to heavy attack after that L1 dodge. I don't think there's a way. Alright, we're up to 12. 13, and wait till I get a crit here. Like, it's going to be a lot more damage. Alright, yeah, I'm almost up to, what was that, like 5,000 crit almost? I'll try to get one more. Alright, 15. I'm going to use my special here. Now, I'm going to I'm gonna get it back up to a level 2 special, and then we'll see what kind of damage that can do. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Just messed up. Was not looking after my... Um, Aw, oh, man. I just let so many stacks drop off. Or probably. Like, they, they didn't drop off yet, but they're going to be. Oh, come on. That didn't hit. Lame. I didn't even get to show the level 2. And all right, well, I knocked off like a hundred and like a hundred thousand life. I feel like we have to do it again now, guys. Right? One more time. I'll just use level two straight away. I won't. I won't um, wait and use level three and stuff like that. Seventeen arm breaks equals two arm breaks for Thor. Yeah, like Thor is still way better, right? No one's no one's arguing that. But this is still like a a, a rank three symbiote Spider Man. Um, And you can do a lot of damage. You can do a lot of damage. Did I stop grinding at 4.6 and missed it? Ah, bummer, man. What? I must have been like holding on like the side of my phone too much or something like that. I didn't get the heavy attack off. I also take a lot of damage because I'm low level. And because I do have to block so much to get these parries. Alright. Um, I'm going to wait a tiny bit longer. And then we're going to use level 2 special. Oh, wow. That was terrible. Now 
Now it's already level 3. Alright, well, let's use level 3. I wonder if that armor break, that last armor break stuck there. It didn't. Alright, that was dumb then. Oh, that does hit. I just want to get to a level 2. Please don't die. They don't, don't have quite as many armor breaks as I did last time. Alright, so yeah, it was almost 20,000. I, I had like 17 armor breaks last time. I only had like 13 or 14 that time. But you guys can see it. Uh, if you... If you... Um, if you actually have them at like rank 5 and then do that, like his damage will be crazy. Alright, let's get out of here. Trying to farm meals? Nah, I was just messing around. Brian, is level up event or class advancement event better? Uh, technically, the level up event is is like w it will be more rewarding in the long run um, if you're able to score enough. The thing about that though is like you score points easier in the individual class level up events. Um, so you can just level up. You can max out a, a three star champion and get all the points you need. Um, or you can take a four-star champion to rank three, level 30, and get all the points you need. Whereas if you um, if you did that during a level up solo event, you would not max out. Um, so I prefer to level up during the individual ones. Yours is rank five, Frojo. Have you ever done that? Like, what's the highest crit you can you can get? If you have any idea offhand, uh, uh, is, I don't know if that's something you would uh, just have off the top of your head. Let me get some helps here. I'm sure I'm not the only one going for uh, those four-star shards. Hey, chat, what is the best way to farm gold? Uh, arena. Hands down. Is this not working? No, it's still going, right? Oh, it's going one at a time. Let me do this then instead. Your channel, you put a video of using uh, Deep Scarlet, which take a decent chunk off Realm Legend Winter Soldier. Yeah, that's that's an amazing way to take down Winter Soldier. Pretty much is uh, just go in there with with Scarlet Witch, and you could do some serious damage. Tonight is what's up, man? Thank you. Hit the help button, please. I need these shards. I still have like I'm not even halfway there. Got my second ever dupe today. Duped my guillotine for the second time. I'm sad now. Ah oh, man, <laughs> I thought you were about to say something awesome. Got a double dupe on guillotine. Ah, uh, that is kind of a bummer. But hey, guillotine is a powerhouse, man. So at least it, at least it was that champion and not some other champion. Um, all right, let me actually get the milestones in this arena, guys. If you don't do this arena, you're missing out. Like, yeah, it's it's only some uh, you know some two star crystals from the milestones and a crystal from the or crystal two are from the rank rewards, um, but it's worth it. It's worth it. Like uh, all of these are gonna turn into max signature ability crystals for me. Um, so eventually these are gonna be 110 three star shards each. So yeah, I'm gonna be gaining like over 500 from the four in the milestone and the premium hero uh, from the ranked. Brian, do you know how much scene is making off YouTube? No, no idea. It's it can't be anything. 
too crazy though, like, he's still living in a shed, right? I didn't mean that in like a, in like a bad way either, I just meant like, it's not like he's uh, doing this to get rich quick or something like that. Brian, why do you consider double dupes bad? Uh, I mean, they're not always bad. No, don't use your level 3. Okay. They're not always bad. Um, enough to fly to New York for Comic Con. That's true. Uh, double dupes are not always bad, but yeah, for the most part, I'd rather just have a new champion or um, have a champion awakened that I didn't already have awakened. Uh, their abilities don't scale particularly well, like the higher the signature ability. Uh, there are exceptions. Some champions you really want at signature 99. Uh, oh man, all these matchups suck. Double Groot and Electra. Whatever, let's just fight a Groot. Um, and if you go, if you want a high prestige champion, then you do want that champion as high signature ability as level, as high of a signature ability level as possible. Uh, but other than that, yeah, I'd rather just get something new. Roasted, shots fired, no man. See you now, friends. He knows it. He knows I wouldn't uh, be trying to rip on him like that. How come you forgot Seaton's pizza order today? Yeah. I was just so nervous, you know? Uh, delivering pizza to a, a YouTube celebrity. Oh wow, am I really getting wrecked here by this Wolverine? Do you stream other games, Brian? No, I do not. Um, I have streamed a couple times in the past. I streamed uh, before Twitch was a thing, on like the platform before Twitch. Uh, I streamed a tiny bit of World of Warcraft. Um, I, um, I man, I could have, I could have been, I could have been one of those you like the early streamer guys that are now like all set. Um, who just have like a, a huge following because they were one of the first few because back then I had like 40 to 100 people watching or something like that watch me play arena um, and, and before twitch like that was a lot of people um, and then I also streamed a tiny bit of hearthstone that was more of just for fun for like a couple of days and then I didn't really like it so yeah I stopped doing that watch me make a parry video of what you said I don't care if he does. That doesn't bother me. Just passed 300 subs like two days ago. Captain, nice man. Brian, did you did you see Rich the Man's impression opening where he did you? Yeah, that was funny. That was funny. Brian, I found like cell on my computer. What do I do next? Ah, uh, man. Don't touch it. It's an addiction. Have you tried the new Hostess Twinkie Cupcake and Snowball Ice Creams? They're great. Nah. I was the number eight warlock uh, in in the world, and wow, my boy was number one healer in the world. Nice. How do you measure number one healing though? What are you talking about? Like, like healing meters? Like the uh, oh man, what are those things called? Like the raid logs or whatever they're called. Talking about like the DPS meters or yeah, I can't remember exactly what they were called. Uh. Maybe it was just raid logs, right? Something like that? I don't know. Completion! Dude, I did some completion. Get off my back, man. Uh, what do I have in completion anyway? Can't be that bad. I saved all my uh, my heroic for completion. Let me check this out. The hair is looking gorgeous tonight, Ryan. Thanks, man. I tried. I did something a little different with it this time around, you know? Yeah, we're at 845,000. Uh, Alright, so I'm a little bit lower than I thought. 23,000. 
<laughs> okay, okay, stop yelling at your boss. Lucky Dutch Dutch isn't here, man. He'd time you out right now. <laughs> I hate completion, guys. I actually do. Uh, completion is the easiest of the three-day events for most alliances out there. Uh, but I'd rather just do arena. <laughs> I don't know why. I just like arena that much more. I wonder if you can use a Bluetooth keyboard to play MCOC. Uh, you're really not supposed to. It's supposed to just be touchscreen. Uh, there are like workarounds and stuff like that, but they're like bannable workarounds, so yeah. As far as I know, they're bannable at least. Have you beat Road to Labyrinth? I did beat Road to Labyrinth, yes. Uh, right now I'm saving up units to do my first run through of the Labyrinth. Um, I should get enough units by like May. If I can keep up this like five to six thousand units a month rate. Um, but that's assuming I don't spend units at all, which I do spend some units here and there. Um, that potion sale is still going on, so by tomorrow i got to make a decision uh, exactly what I want to buy. I already bought like 10 of the four uh, level 4 potions and stuff like that. I might pick up another 10. What's up guys? Everyone's talking to me a lot tonight. I like it. Dude, everyone always talks to you, man. Unless you're not talking about the stream, but in stream. Keep spending on refreshes too, that's true. Um, I didn't spend a ton on refreshing, but I, I definitely have spent on it a bit. Um, and Dormammu, guys, I'm probably dropping some units on Dormammu. Um, I'm probably going to do the Iron Man Arena to just to get more units, honestly. Uh, to get more units, did not mean to go that one, get more units and uh, get another 20 signature levels. Because, yeah, Iron Man is pretty close to maxing out. And although I really don't want to pull max signature crystals from my 4 stars char or crystals, uh, it's bound to happen. So, um, I might as well start maxing them out as, as best I can, you know. Brian, will you do an opening for the Manic Romantic Crystal from the login? Uh, not like a whole video just on that. I'll probably open it up at, at the end of one of the live streams, to be honest. Um, that's when I normally open up some uh, some of the minor, more minor crystals like that. I open up a, a tiny bit of crystals at the end of each live stream. Normally it's just like an alliance crystal and, and some, uh, some arena crystals. Uh, but occasionally I've opened up some other things. Uh, was it yesterday or like the day before yesterday where I opened up my, my lunar new year crystals? Whatever they were, like the greater ones, whatever they were. Got some decent rewards from that. If you want so many units, spend your battle chips. I always do. Uh, I trust me. I've spent millions and millions of battle chips. Um, it's not like I don't open them, but uh, I like to have them there as kind of a reserve. You know, in case something comes out and I just like I just spent all my units. Uh, I, I know where I can get some more, you know? Got a rank 5 Scarlet Witch in Master Mode is easy now. Nice. You're on 4.4 .4 of Roads to the Labyrinth and stuck. Uh, just take your time. Make sure that you save up a bunch of uh, free 4-hour crystals. Uh, there's no rush to complete it. Um, Labyrinth is insane. Uh, so yeah, no rush to complete it. You'll, you'll get through it. You'll get through it. Brian, I need help. I have 5, 440, 4 stars, X-23, Thor, Thor and Jane Foster, Daredevil Classic, uh, Agent Venom, all unduped. Should I upgrade another 334 star and only dupes classes or wait and upgrade 440 to 5? Uh, my suggestion when it comes to that kind of thing is always, always upgrade your champions like as high as you can get them. So I would take one of your 440s to rank five.
We petition Kabam for a max SIG icon or some indicator to tell the champion SIG is max level, please. I'm sure they're aware of that request. I can't be the only one that's, uh... Well, I mean, you just said it too. Like, the two of us can't be the only two of the people that want it. Uh, I'm sure somebody's put that request out there before. Maybe they'll do it one day. Maybe they won't. Who knows? Are the different background effects distracting? Play an Android and don't see the animation in the background? Uh, no, not at all. I Half the time, I don't even notice what's going on in the background. I just look at the two characters. Uh, the rest of the stuff literally is just... Just like background noise kind of thing. Do you recommend buying feature crystals? Absolutely not. Um, you can get lucky in them and it could save you a whole lot of time, uh, but for the most part you're gonna get crap out of them. For the most part it's it's a waste. I've never bought any featured crystals. The only crystals that I've actually bought before uh, with units were the greater gifting crystals. Partially because of the uh, the event that was going on where you got some rewards just for gifting those things out and partially because they were really good. I don't regret them at all other than the fact that I blew all my units before uh, I could have purchased vision. Trying out the keyboard, I like this except I have to press percent on the screen still. Hmm. Oh, gold realms or quests, whatever it's called, start up again. I have no, I have no clue at all. Um, I'm, honestly, I'm shocked that they brought back the dimensional rifts so soon. Uh, the gold realms, I don't know when they're going to come back. Probably not for a while. Uh, I'm sure a lot of people still have a lot of gold. Like, that's that's probably what they're going to do. They're probably going to monitor people's gold, uh, wait for it to drop down, let people struggle a little bit, uh, make them feel like they're kind of drowning in a uh, in a sea of, of no gold, um, and then bring them back. Thanks for helping me feel better. I thought I was going to barf. You're welcome. I don't know how I'm helping you not barf, but I'm glad you're not barfing. Just hit the like button. You guys should do it too. So I'm talking about Frojo. Thanks, man. <laughs> totally messed up today. Thought it was skill advancement period, so I took my four star crossbones to 330. I went to claim the rewards, and it was mutant advancement. Ah, dude. <laughs> yeah. I can't say I've ever done that, but man, I can see it happening. My gold is already really low. Did you take advantage of the gold realms when they were out? I actually didn't. I didn't do it myself. But uh, a lot of people I know still have a lot of gold from that. Oh, I could have switched up one of these teams. Oh, well. I wish they would get rid of the stupid portals other than the rifts. I'm not a big fan of them either, Dicer. I'm not, like, especially when it comes to trying to count the energy when a new monthly event quest comes out. It does, it takes a little bit longer now, you know. Uh, it's a little bit more annoying. But at the same time, yeah, whatever, it doesn't, it doesn't really bother me that much. Fall through all the nodes, Frodo. Went from no gold to 10 million dicer. Nice. Like, I, I, man, I have to start farming Catalyst again, guys. Um, I'm going to try to, I really am going to try to level up these new four-star champions that I got before Dramamu. Uh, it's, it's actually going to be a pretty big help. Because, all right, let's say, let's say this. Um, just, just the three four-star champions that I got today. Well, technically I have to level up four of them. 
Um, but let's just say three of them. Um, put a little. Let me do this. Put a little calculator on screen. <laughs> Um, so I get on average for, for a four star champion um, something like 2300, right? Times the three multiplier, um, times three of them, so 20,000. And let's say I did 24 rounds. That's half a million points just with, that's half a million points just with the new three star champions that I got today. Uh, it's kind of unbelievable, it's a lot of points. Don't buy any future crystals. It's spent 30,000 units. Wow, that's a lot of units. On Hood, got all two stars except duped four star cable, Gilly, uh, and Quake. At least you got that cable. Um, but man, yeah, 30,000 units. I know you wanted that Hood. That's a bummer, dude. New three star? Did I say three star? I meant to say four star. If I did. Brian, have you considered 550 uh, four star Star Lord? It'll be the same as rank three five star Star Lord. VRTO did it uh, for Labyrinth of Legends. Uh, I've considered it, but it's really not so efficient. Um, it's. I'm not saying it's impossible. I know people have done it and everything, but I would prefer not to use a four star Star Lord. Um, if anything, like Star Lord is not the only answer to Labyrinth. Um, I would be happy doing it with a different five-star champion, but I, I want to do it with a five-star champion. I don't want to do it with a four-star champion. Um, there's a few that I would try with. Captain Marvel here that I'm fighting with, coincidentally, uh, is one of them. If I got four-star or I mean five-star Captain Marvel, which by the way, I do have enough shards to open up a 5-star crystal. Just kind of debating on whether I want to use them or not. Um, that's Dachi, what's going on, man? Um, so yeah, like, Captain Marvel is is a solution, possibly. Um, I thought about... I thought about Yellow Jacket, but I'm not so sure about Yellow Jacket anymore. I don't think he's such a good solution. Um, but he might be. Uh, Storm would be good if I can duplicate my Storm. Um, there's there's a bunch of things in the five star. If I'm just a little bit more patient, uh, wait and get these units and stuff like that, I'd rather not take my four star star lower to rank five. Yep, then did arena got 14.5 mil. Miss Adam in arena, with two four star crystals. Got Kamala Khan back to back. Bam hates me, dude. That is a streak of absolute terrible luck, man. Wow. Oh man. Got a new super suit today. Is it a burrito wrestling suit? Yeah, what kind of suit did you just get, man? Alright, I'm almost there for these milestones. I'm gonna have to figure out something to do. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. I've actually been playing on the iPad Mini, and I'm starting to like Kamala. She actually changed the size during the fight. You can't see it on the phone. Wait. Like, when you use her heavy attack, she changes size. Are you talking about, like, she changes size constantly throughout the fight, other than heavy attack and her special abilities? Going tonight. Keep grinding, Brian, and stay classy. All right, dude. Have a good one. Should I dupe Rocket Raccoon? Uh, if you can duplicate him through crystal, yes. If you're talking about like using an awakening gem, no. Would people watch live streams on story quests? Uh, I mean, it depends. Uh, is it a difficult story quest? Uh, like Act Five? Absolutely. People are absolutely gonna watch that. Um, I bet there's a lot of people that's gonna be streaming that. 
Um, certain challenges in Act 4 people would watch. Um, master mode. Uh, master mode of the end quest is kind of debatable. The, um, the specialty quests like dimensional uh, rifts and some other things like Chloe's, whatever, they would watch that. Um, I mean, people people aren't really watching this for the arena, though, right? Like, they're watching it just because uh, it's something to grind along with while uh, while chatting and stuff like that, right? Did 4.5 mil for Loki? I'm shocked it was so high. Oh man, you missed out on that one too. Dude, the bad luck streak just continues for you. I'm sorry. Um, yeah, I, I knew Loki was going to go for over 5 million, uh, or at least that's what I thought. Like, my prediction was 5.2 million. I've been off a little bit lately, but I was actually pretty close on that one. I think it was, what, 5.1 million? Here listening while I work on my computer? Yeah, exactly. I'm going to do a story quest stream tomorrow. Uh, cool, man. Uh, I won't be able to tune in tomorrow, no. <laughs> did they really, Seth? <laughs> Somebody did that? Lowest I saw for Loku is 4.86. Really? 4.86? Ah, okay. Did not know that. I really thought it went for like 5.1. Interesting. Alright, so I wasn't as close as I thought, I guess. $2 donation from Doug1.1. Thank you, Doug. Appreciate it, man. You don't leave any comment if you wanted to say something... Uh, I think we've been through this before with you though, Doug, right? I think last time you didn't really want to say anything either, if I remember correctly. In any case, man, much appreciated. Thank you very much. Hashtag Doug is Doug. Do you think Moon Knight could do Realm of Legends? Uh, Moon Knight could do a good chunk of it. Um, I don't think Moon. I don't think it's possible for Moon Knight to be Wolverine. I could be mistaken with uh, that one mastery, but I don't think you stack enough debuffs during any of the phases. Um, but any champion could beat. All of Realm of Legends except for Wolverine, so. You do Realm of Legends on a certain phase of the moon. So he can beat uh, Wolverine, is that what you're saying? Or do you, are you just saying that like the other champions are easier on, on one phase? Right, what are the cutoff numbers for Iron Man? Uh, Iron Man went for something like 7.15 or something like that. Uh, somebody in my alliance got like just under 7.1 and they got like 440. Um, in the three star arena, I don't know what the exact numbers are, but I got I got the three star version of Iron Man for two hundred and seventy seven. I think is what I had. Trying to steal labyrinths with Electro and let yourself get hit and spend thousands. That's the best idea I've ever heard, Dash Dashi. <laughs> Aha, Doug, I see what you're talking about now. You said uh, Frojo already got you. Uh, awesome, then.
He can be uh, around Legend Wolverine in a certain phase of the moon. Interesting. That makes uh, Moon Knight a little bit more interesting for me. He doesn't trigger critical hits, so it doesn't trigger Wolverine's healing. Uh, wait. Doesn't his healing not come from critical? I thought his, I thought his healing just came from regular hits, too. Does it not? Um, I think we're almost done here. Let me do one more round just to ensure that I get my extra two-star crystal from this arena. Uh, and then I'm good. Brian, if I donate for small crystal opening, will it happen? Ah, uh, man, does that make me a sellout? <laughs> Uh, I don't know, man. What are you talking about? Small crystal opening here. I don't. I really don't want to do much of an opening. Ah, uh, messed up my combo mid hits. Let's see that level three. Let's see that Joe fix it level three that I never see. Right, if you dupe a three-star in arena that you already have duped, do you get the plus eight signature levels? Yes, you get the si you get the plus eight signature levels, but you only get twenty of the four-star shards. Um, you do get the full ISO benefits as well, though. That was only critical. Let me check my Wolverine. Yeah, I think it's just any hit. I've heard that Rumble Legends Wolverine is different. I don't know if he got changed when they... Um, when they changed Wolverine or something like that. Because I think at one point it might have only been critical hits or something. I want to see Phoenix's level 3 also. Let's take a look at that. I actually like Phoenix's level 3 a lot. I think Phoenix's level 1 and level 2 look stupid. Uh, or maybe not her level 1, just her level 2. I think Phoenix's level 2 looks stupid. Uh, but her level 3 is, is sick. I like her level 3. And her level 1 is just okay. Right, don't give me any spoilers, and anyone that doesn't give me spoilers will face the wrath of the Guardian. Uh, but on a scale of 1 to 10, rate your 4 stars today. If I rated it, That'd be a slight spoiler. Um, I'll just say this, Dachi Dachi. Uh, and you'll have to go watch it. <laughs> I mean, or I could just spoil it for you if you wanted, but if you don't want me to spoil it, then you just gotta go watch it. It's always been any hits at first people were using Doctor Strange Special 3 only to beat him without hitting him. Okay. Alright, done in this arena. Let me just hit these helps. I don't know why I'm hitting these helps, honestly. I don't need those champions refreshed. Uh, let me see how much time I have left in this arena, and then we'll figure out what to do next. Yeah, look at this, guys. If I had these four champions leveled up, that's an extra two rounds in this arena also, uh, which would actually be super helpful. Because, like, I'm going to have to do this... I'm going to have to do this one three more times. It's not the end of the world, doing this arena three more times, right? Um... But I could probably, I could maybe get it done in like two if I had more champions leveled up. All right, so 30 minutes left. All right, cool. Um, I'm gonna go watch it and then get 10 ads on stream to give you ad money. No, dachi dachi, no man. <laughs> Just watch it and then <laughs> and then come back. Brian, here's how you get free units. Uh, go to the unit store and there's a 99.99 button. You click it and type your password and you should be able to get your free units. Is that a hack? Am I going to get banned if I do that? Is that for real? Like how many units is it? You're not serious, right? 
Let me go check this out. Hold on. Let me. I got rewards here. Yeah, let me get this reward real quick. Are you serious? I can get free units if I just. I go to the unit store. What was, what was step two? I go to the unit store. Uh, 99.99 button. Let me see if I can find that. I, I see 29.99, 99.499, 4.99, 4.99. 4.99. I, I don't, I don't see one for. Ah oh, man, it must be like a, must be like the UK version or something like that, man. I don't see one here for 9.99, 9.99.99. Nine, I can't do it. You guys are lucky who have that 99.99 option. It's just not in my game. It's not in my, in my region, I guess. Oh, hide your new champs. Yeah. Sorry about that, Dachi Dachi, man. <laughs> when are the rifts coming, bro? In a few days, like two days now. It just rolled over to the 13th. Uh, two days. Possibly, possibly like 36 hours, depending on like UTC time or whatever it comes out to be, how many, however many hours. I have seventy nine ninety nine and one fifty nine ninety nine. Ugh. All right, what to do, guys? Uh, let me let me go move in alliance quest real quick. We'll do that first. I wish I had some some uh, alliance war I could stream for you guys. I wouldn't mind doing that tonight. Uh, nice though. Looks like we're we're moving along pretty well today. Maybe, just maybe, I can get to the Alliance War boss before these other guys do. Although lately I've been taking this path solo, so maybe not, because it's still going to take me quite a few more moves. Try a nice troll right back at him. I tried. What score you need for 500 shards? Um, it's like 2.1 to 2.5. 3 or 2.4 is, is the cutoff usually 2.1 million to 2.3 ish million something like that I don't know I'm gonna go for like 2.6 million just to play it a little bit safe if I miss out with 2.6 million then oh well I just did the hack so many times weird thing though suddenly I don't have enough money for rent oh man must have spent it all on uh on Pokemon cards or something like that. Alright, let's do this fight. What am I doing? This is Cyclops, right? Yeah, this should be Cyclops. <clears throat> I probably should do this with Ronin, honestly, and try to save some life. Eh, nah, let's just do it. Oh, that kick to the face, guys. What? Whoa, 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 whoa. How did I just mess up that, that badly? Man, rocky start. Lost so much life right there. It's going to be hard to gain it back. I uh, basically have to try to gain it back on Storm here. So I think I'm still above that 25% threshold. Am I? Did anyone see processing on the screen? I didn't really look for it that hard, to be honest. Brian, do you think 68 million is a good Alliance quest at the moment? Uh, let me see what I'm at. <laughs> Yeah, we're at 52, so sounds pretty good, Frodo. <laughs> Wish I had some food you streaming early distracted me and I forgot to order pizza. Now they're closed. Oh, man, dude. That's a bummer. it has got to be someplace that's open, isn't there? Ultron's uh, special one does more damage uh, than the bleed stacks on the opponent. Uh, yeah, I have uh, I have recoil, so I just end the fights without using any specials. Did anyone hear about the flood in Fresno? I did not. Uh, hopefully, it's nothing too crazy. Um, all right. 
so I have energy. We could either spend this energy or we could just mess around in doing things like Realm of Legends. Um, I might just spend some energy though. It's going to be pretty busy during uh, Dormammu, so maybe I should just spend energy. Now, not that we'll do your job, uh, bomber dude. Um, maybe I should like actually just use some energy refills and stuff like that. No processing. Okay, good. All right, good. I'm still above 25% though. I'm not going to use Ultron for the next fight. I'm going to save Ultron for that storm fight and see if I can get a double regen off. Off to uh, bust out Ronin for the next one. Um, okay. So I'm in Master. I guess I should start doing some Master, right? Do Master, I could do Beginner. Actually, you know what? Let's do this, because I wanted to test this out. I might as well do it on stream. I'm going to do a run-through of Beginner one time. I'm going to go back and do it 100%. Uh, I'm going to do it one time, and then I'm actually going to purchase the offer at the end. Because apparently you can get some, some champions out of that crystal that you could not otherwise get. So let's do that. Uh, let me switch up the champions, though. Should throw in Cable. Nah, I'm going to go with X-23. Gotta love X-23. Oh, dude, JR with a $20 donation. That is a huge donation, man. Very generous. Thank you so much. Ryan, your videos have helped me progress a ton. I really appreciate it. Here are some Earth units to, uh, to keep following the dream. Thanks from one drummer to another. Jay, nice, man. JR. Wow, man. Very much so appreciated. Uh, it's awesome that uh, you also play drums. One of these days, one of these days, I gotta get some uh, some recorded drum on the channel. All right. Yeah, I'll just take the short path. Might as well. <laughs> I like how you call them Earth units too. Brian, is it raining hard where you're at? Cause it's coming down here. Uh, and I know we live in the same state. No, I don't think it's raining at all, actually. It's hard to tell because it's, you know, dark out, but I don't think it's donating. Uh, <laughs> I just read somebody saying donating. Uh, I don't think it's raining. That donation lagged the hell of the stream for me. It lagged the stream? Really? What offer? Uh, well, I'll show you after I go through a one-time clear. Um, shouldn't take that long at all. Does the Road to Labyrinth take multiple exploration runs to 100% or is it one time and done? Uh, one time and done. One and done. I think in Act 5 they should give away 3 star Thanos for regular completion and 3 star Mysho for 100%. Ah, that's probably a little too much. Um... I wouldn't mind seeing a way to get those champions, but that might be a little bit too much. It'd be a little too common at that point. Is it donating rain? <laughs> yeah. The snow is annoying. Snow is annoying. Like the first day it snows, I like it, and then after that, when it's just like hanging around, it's kind of annoying. How much is the offer? I don't know. I actually don't know much about um, about the offer. I think it's only for beginner quests. I hope I didn't miss out on the other offers that could give. It's new one-star champions. That's what that's what the offer is. Uh, it's like a crystal that has a chance at them apparently. What a featured crystal today. Dupe my X my four-star X twenty-three. Nice. Uh, I think I'm gonna do like the casino. Scrolled up. Um, get up and then walk away. Yeah. You got lucky this time. It ain't always going to be like that. Are you sad because you've reverted back to your ways of having a crush on a girl and at this point it's too much for you? Dude, don't tell me you have a crush on that girl that's stalking you, Dachi Dachi. It's 200 units? Okay. Who 
Who'd you use to complete Realm of Legends? Uh, I used um, Star Lord. Took down like half of the bosses. Hulk took down half the bosses, and then um, I used uh, Black Widow for Wolverine. No, it's not the Stalker. <laughs> that would be a crush. That'd be in a relationship. <laughs> Well, I don't know, man. You could have a crush on her, but you know she's crazy or something like that, so you want to stay away. So what if it doesn't sound like a real thing? <laughs> Alright, uh, I'm going to 100% this anyway. I was just trying to look around for the best path. These opponents are so difficult looking. I know. These fights are intense. Brian, I was doing something else and missed your comment. What's this one star offer you're speaking of? Uh, well, you'll, you'll see when I when I get it. Um, apparently there's a crystal out there that has a chance to give you different one star champions. So yeah, I'm just gonna go for that. Just spent over an hour figuring out uh, how much mercury is contained within uh, thermosol within every vaccine currently being made in the United States? Is it a lot? I'm back in WoW, $20 donation. Yeah. Yeah, man, JR hooked it up. <laughs> Maybe those $20 will help you do that free unit glitch for $99.99. For $99 it's not on my account, guys. I can't do it. That's, I wish I could. It's not, not in my region. When do dimensional rifts end? They end at the end of February. So they go from like February 15th until the 28th. So you do want to finish up all of the event quests or as much of it as you can uh, ahead of time. Um, or like, like don't wait until like the last day, right? Because it does take some energy to get through the dimensional rifts also. I can tweet it to you. I know you like data. Ah, sure. Brian ranked 105th with 9 mil score. Got my first feature. Nice. Congrats on the first time feature. The question is, are you going to do it again? I, I'm pretty sure I'm going to. Um, you're kind of waiting till mid February to start questing. Uh, I'm pretty sure that I'm going to get Iron Man next time around. I'm going to go for it. Uh, maybe it'll be like one of those game time decisions where I'll. I might not. Like halfway through, I might just be like, eh, forget this. But I think I'm going to try going for Iron Man. Just get those 20 SIG levels. I'm so triggered right now. I beat Realm of Legends, Winter Soldier, but got no heals. And then noticed it said possible rewards. Wait, I thought it was guaranteed that you at least get one healing. Because I know there's like a team healing and like a level 3 healing. Uh, just a single heal. I thought you always got the level 3 single heal. Really? You'd... That's not an always thing. What's your opinion on the Iron Family? Um, I like Superior Iron Man because of his synergy. And the level 2 special hits kind of hard. Same thing with like the regular Iron Man. Um, other than that, eh, they're always kind of whatever champions. Um, they're cool to have, but none of them are, like, super amazing. Uh, they're not bad. Actually, they're, they're pretty good early on in the game, because that healing, uh, you can, you can trigger that, like, once per fight and just constantly be healing. So, it's actually pretty good for a newer player out there to, uh, have a high-level Iron Man, I think. Pretty sure I'll never get a featured. Dicer man, you never know. That's what I said too. 
That's what happened to me after the milestones. I was like, man, it's just Iron Man. Yeah, I, I could I could totally see that happening to myself too, Seth. Uh, but the thing is, like, I'm, I plan on spending some units to get Dormammu. Because uh, the first, like, the Saturday, even during, the, like, the Saturday arena, um, I'm going to be busy for a good portion of Saturday. So I can't do, like, a crazy long stream. Uh, I'm still going to try to do a pretty long one. I might do something like, I don't know, I might pull, like, a 12-hour like a stream to help me out. Maybe a little bit longer than that, even. I don't know. Um, but I'm going to be busy for most of that day, so I'm, I'm going to have to spend some units. Uh, and if I go for Iron Man, yeah, it's just going to help me get those units. It's going to help balance that out. Brian, uh, did you have to pay for that Karnak drawing, or did you do it for free? Uh, no, I, I paid for it. I, I paid him. I uh, even if he offered it for free, I, nah, man, I would have paid him, like, he's, um, you know, like, artists don't make a ton of money unless you're, like, doing regular work anyway, so, yeah, I wanted to support his, his dreams and stuff like that, too, so, uh, I paid him for it. I work two jobs in the ground, he puts me to sleep. Alright, that's true. <laughs> so, maybe, maybe in that case... Um, I thought at first I thought you were saying just because you don't have enough champions, but in that case, you may be right. The offer you're looking for costs 200 units, one hero crystal, 503 star shards, 1500 premium. Can you buy it more than once, Hal Jordan? Do you know if you can buy it more than once? Units from battleships have been horrendous lately. All I get is gold. I hear that from some people, but yeah, it's, it's a pretty good mix for me still. Ordered up two more commissions from Drew today. Uh, Asked for Phoenix and Ghost Rider. Nice, man. I'm looking forward to see how those turn out. You, Art, Art of Chaos, you got the, uh, the cable one, right? If I'm not mistaken. Uh, that was your cable. Yeah, let me just take the short path. We'll try to get through this with as few energy refills as possible, I guess. Hero Crystal, give either a one or two star. Oh man, someone has the name Brian Grant Shiny Head. Yeah. What's the worst thing you ever got in trouble for as a kid, as a teen, and as an adult? Ah, oh, man. As a kid, um... Yeah, I just got it yesterday in the mail, and the cable looks amazing. Yeah, he did a good job on that one, man. Um, all right, so as a kid, I'll just tell you the one, like the worst one as a kid. Um, there's two. One of one of them is kind of a funny story. One of them is is not so funny. So I'll tell you the not so funny one first. Um, I was throwing rocks like over a fence, right? Uh, as a kid. And I couldn't even get the rocks over this fence. Like, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm like four years old or something like that. I don't know. I'm at, like, uh, like a, like my, my brother's baseball game or something like that. Um, I'm throwing these rocks over the fence, and I'm with someone else there who's, like, much older than me. He's also throwing rocks over this fence. And on the other side of the fence is, like, you know, the street. And there's, there's cars parked there and everything like that. And uh, it, like, dented one of the, the cars, apparently. Uh, and I got blamed for it even though I couldn't even throw the rocks over the fence. I, I very distinctly remember that I couldn't even get these rocks over the fence. But yeah, apparently, uh, like, my parents had to had to pay them money or something like that. I don't know. Um, how big are the rocks? I'm only four years old, so they're not even that big rocks. I don't know. Uh, all right, I'll tell you the, the next time that I... I don't even know if this is, like, the time that I got in trouble the most, but this is, this is a very memorable uh, experience for me. Uh, I was playing this game called um, Shark Attack. It's a board game. If you guys have ever played it, I can uh, I can show you a picture of it actually, so just so you guys so you guys all know what I'm talking about here. Um, hang on, let me turn this off real quick, just in case something crazy pops up when I type in Shark Attack. Shark Attack board game. Oh, I wish we could watch the commercial for it right now. But yeah, I would get like copyright stuff or whatever. Okay, so this is Shark Attack. 
It's a board game. Uh, you put your pieces on the, on the board or whatever, and I don't even remember what you do. You like roll these dice or something like that, and you have to like move your piece around. And basically, the idea is don't get eaten by the shark. Um, something like that, right? And I was playing this game. And, uh, <laughs> I'm playing this game, and I'm playing with my brother and one of my brother's friends, right? My, my brother's older. Um, I'm playing this game, and I, I was like, oh, man, I have to, I have to use the bathroom, right? I have to use the bathroom. But I felt like my brother and his, his friend were gonna, were gonna cheat and, like, move my piece, uh, and I was gonna get eaten by the shark or something like that, right? When I came back, at this point, I'm, I'm, like, maybe 10 years old, something like that, right? Um... And they're, they're, like, assuring me, like, no, you know, I'm not going to move your piece. And I'm like, yeah, right. Uh, so I didn't want to leave. Um, so I grabbed the plastic bag that, <laughs> that the pieces are contained in while they're in the box. Uh, <laughs> and basically, I uh, proceed to pee in the bag uh, <laughs> and, and don't leave so that I can make sure they're not going to cheat while we're playing this game. Um... And then I didn't want to get in trouble for peeing in this bag. And I was like, well, where can I put this bag now? Uh, and my brother was like, just put it behind put it behind the, uh, the radiator here. We're in, like, in our basement or something like that. Uh, and, of course, that ended up, like, stinking up the house a little bit. Um, <laughs> and then the worst part is I paid my brother and his friend. I paid both of them not to tell on me. It was only a dollar. I gave each of them a dollar, but I'm 10 years old. Like, that dollar, man. I, I paid them each a dollar, and then they told on me, like, right away. I got grounded for that one. So, yeah, I don't know. It's I didn't exactly, like... I, I've never been, like, arrested or anything like that before as a kid. Um... Ooh, actually, there was one time where I came close, but I don't want to tell that story, really. That's not a good story to tell. Um, I was a little bit older for that, what I was just about to say, too. But, yeah, I don't know. You didn't think of getting rid of it? No, man. I don't know. I was, I was 10 years old. I just peed in this bag. We were playing Shark Attack. I paid them a dollar not to tell me. And, yeah, backfired. I can't believe you just told that story. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> that started the addiction of Brian peeing in bags. <laughs> yeah. That's why you guys don't see me get up during live streams. And there's always a plastic bag within uh, reaching distance. <laughs> no, of course, uh, man, somebody's gonna actually believe that. No, I, I don't actually do that. Brian, two dollars could have went towards that ninety nine ninety nine glitch. I got those two dollars back. All right, after they told on me. I told on them and it said, I, you know, I paid them $2 or whatever, and I, I got the $2 back. I still got grounded. They didn't get in trouble. Um, but yeah, it wasn't that bad. I mean, I was, I was only 10 years old. I think I, I got grounded for like a couple of days or something like that. You know, it wasn't, wasn't a big deal. Brian actually made it for once. Welcome. <laughs> Brian secretly has a Ziploc bag near him uh, to be in stream to keep the, the grind flowing. Yeah, nice one. <laughs> now he uses bedpans, yeah. Are you better keep me up on updated on these commissions you're getting? Hit me up online. Um, they're on his Instagram page. I didn't you know what I didn't check it out today. Did he did he start working on them already? Do you know? Let me go check that out real quick. Oh, 
Oh, yeah, there was another sick one that he did here. Uh, he colored in this one before he had it just in black and white. This looks really good in color. Like, I'll show you guys the black and white one. Um, it looks, like, pretty cool here, but, um, yeah, in color, it just looks way better, right? Trinity <laughs> Toyota, she honestly did your wife doing dishes and messing with uh, plastic grocery bags. She was your accomplice that night. Yeah. Hey, Brian, uh, what do I do if Kabam has taken away two Stony Mastery cores from inventory? They took them away from your inventory? I've never heard of anything like that before. Right now, you got to tell the almost rest of the story? No, I, yeah, I, I can't tell that one. That would not be good. Maybe, maybe one day. I don't know. Probably not, though. Honestly, that was... It's kind of funny, but it's also not something I'm uh, all that proud of. I'll just say I didn't really do anything wrong. I was just kind of with people that were doing stuff that went wrong and actually like yeah no I, I can't say it <laughs> never mind just gonna drop that one Brian read my last message alright dodge dodge what would you say um he goes to the bathroom runs has to put his bag behind the radiator <laughs> yeah <laughs> We got P Tin Man of Yellow, and now we've got Brian P Tin Man Grant. All right, let me get let me get off this, this uh, Instagram here. Ooh, but apparently he's got a uh, he's got a sale on his commissions here, twenty bucks. Not bad. I think he normally charges like thirty or thirty-five bucks or something like that. All right. If you don't want to miss Brian's streams, follow these easy steps. Go to Console Champion, uh, subscribe, and hit the bell to the right of the super subscription button. Uh, enable notifications. Yes. Oh, Brian is such a small MCC world that Art and I are in the same alliance and just found out we were both watching these streams. Interesting, man. Interesting. Right, my throat hurts. Say a story with a calming voice. Uh, once upon a time, in a land far, far away, there was a marshmallow man and his friend. I don't know. <laughs> I got no stories. I got no stories. What was the story of the shark game? Uh, I just told it. I, I'm not going to repeat that story for a very long time. So, yeah. <laughs> right, where's the donate a, a pee bag but empty and new, of course. Uh, it's, it's directly south of the, uh, the little smiley face icon. To the right is the money icon. You don't want to go that way. You want to go south. Find the bag icon. And I guess I missed these new one-star offers. Yeah, I'm, I'm really curious about it. I'm going to check it out here. we got one more to go. Um, what's a good path? Let's take the long path, get the long path over with. Yeah, let's just do that. Let's take the long one. Wait, how much energy is it? Uh, maybe that's too much energy. We'll take a short path. Now we never get to hear the Marshmallow Man story. Yeah, I've got. I, I don't even know where I was gonna go with that. Where's the weirdest place you've gone to the bathroom? Uh, I mean, that might have been one of them. Uh, that's that's probably it. I don't know. There's some other like gross stories that I could say about that, but yeah, I 
You guys, you guys really don't want to hear that. I figure the the pee in the bag is like a borderline uh, a gross, but also funny, so it's fine, right? Uh, but the other stories would like just be gross. So yeah. Did any of these pets have tier twos on it? I should have. Uh, oh man, I should have went around the other way. What was I thinking? Don't know why I went around this way. Oh well, let's just take this bath. Does Batman keeps ignoring my question? I'm sorry, man. Let me let me see what you've been asking here. Don't do it on purpose. Um. Hey Brian, just wondering, what's the score you shoot for to get the four star shards? Aha. Okay. Uh, four star shards. I this is only my second time ever going for them. Uh, I'm gonna go for about 2.6 million. Um, the cutoff, I believe, is usually around 2.1 to 2.3 million. It's roughly around that area, but of course, if I'm going for it, I don't want to go just to the cutoff. I want to go a little bit higher if I can. Um, if I miss out too, like technically the cutoff, it could it could be on the rise. Who knows? It could be higher than 2.6. But if I miss out, it's not the end of the world. It's not like I'm missing out on a new champion. Um, it would just be a, a bit of a bummer. So yeah, I'm not going to push it too hard. I'm just going to get to 2.6. Brian, you got solo events? Not really. Um, it's just mutant advancement, which I don't have the uh, catalyst for. Otherwise, I'd be leveling up Storm. Ah, oh, never mind. I, I was for a second there. I was thinking about leveling up Five Star Storm, but now I don't want to do that. Uh, and then Arena wins, which we'll get back to in a little bit here. I definitely do want to get that twenty percent reward for, um, or the, or the not even twenty percent, the top ten percent reward for PVP wins. Uh, so. I definitely got to hit up that arena for that too. We have several veterans in here, so we don't want to get into stories of weird places to pee poop. Uh, we all have crazy stories, that's true. I'm sure everyone in here has some kind of crazy story when uh, nature called and got an answer. Miss my peace story. All right, let me let me see this. I don't know if I'm gonna read these out loud. I don't I don't really want to read too many of these out loud. Let me see. <laughs> I used to spell my name in P on the fence when I was seven to impress my dad and his trunk friends. Uh, I even put the dot in the I <laughs> in P, uh, and each letter was separate. It's pretty skilled, man. I'm sure. Uh, I'm sure a bunch of uh, drunk adults would find that impressive. <laughs> All right, yeah, we need to change the subject though. This is this is too much for this topic. <laughs> I did just read your story though. So many don't know, but yeah, I'm gonna stop reading them out loud. <laughs> Hey Brian, how strong is Dormammu? I don't know yet. Don't know yet. Uh, I know I'm gonna go for him, and that's about all I know. All I'll say is, <laughs> all I'll say is, road trip container too small, bad day. <laughs> that does sound like a bad day. Do you play those drums? I do. Uh, I can actually reach them right now. I'm tapping on one of the cymbals here. So yeah, they're actually really close to me. Um, all right, wait, wait, wait. Let's see what this offer is. Why does this look like a two-star hero crystal?
That is a one star hero crystal, right guys? This is pretty expensive for 200 units for what you get. But if it's for a new one star, then I'm going to do it. I can give one or two star. Seeing a lot of do it's, buy it's, don't do it. Get it, otherwise it's gone forever. Do it for the stream. Do it for the zip lock. <laughs> it's one or two stars, don't do it. Do it, no balls. No, please save your units. Save it for Labyrinth. Oh man, I needed like it's it's a potential new champion that I could not otherwise get though, guys. That's what you don't understand. It might be a two star. I would hate to see a two star out of this. I wish that was at least like some regular energy refills in there, right? Three of the small ones. Honestly, what does it matter? You make four thousand units in a month. That's true. And that's including expenses. Otherwise, it'd be more. Actually, it still is more, even with the expenses. Um, guys, I'm doing it. Let's pop this thing open. You can tap on it for more info. I tried tapping on it. Uh, nothing came up. Nothing came up. Let me see if that's a one-time only offer. Yeah, there's a one-time only offer. I just have these other ones from the uh, the opening today. Okay, let me claim this crystal and then uh, let's just pop it open. Make sure I don't have any other crystals. Just claim. Nope. Okay, good. Ah oh, man. I hope it's a new one-star champion, guys. I would not mind spending 200 units to get new one-star champions. But if I'm just getting like a two-star Ant-Man or something like that, I'll be kind of bummed. Wait, Ant-Man is a two-star champion, right? I think. If I get a two-star anything... Okay, get a one or two star hero, so it is legit. How do you get more of these? Like I, I saw somebody on Reddit say they had they got more than one. Or maybe they just had like multiple accounts or something like that. Hmm. I like the way this crystal looks. It's got like this, uh, this cool glow to it. It's different than the other one, right? Let me. All right, never mind. Actually, let me not even do it. I'm just gonna go back. Ah, all right. One star champion. Please be something new. Please be something new. Please be something new. Come on. Maybe complete one hundred percent. Maybe. Kang for the one star, hopefully. Oh, these are two stars. No, no, no. No, that's already a one star that I had. Ah, oh, man. This is literally worst case scenario, guys. It's not even a duplicate two star champion. It's a duplicate one star champion. Rip 200 <laughs> units. No, man. What a waste. Try to get uh, normal hero crystal when you first start. That's the only other way I know. Yeah. So one star jug in there. Yeah, one star jug. That's what I was... Like, I don't even like juggernaut, but I would have loved to get a juggernaut. A one star juggernaut. 
I don't think I have that as a one-star champion, right? Sadly, guys, if, if they came out with this offer again next month, I would purchase this offer again. Yeah, I would have I would have loved to get a, a one star juggernaut. I would have loved one star juggernaut. Um <laughs> What a waste. What a waste. Alright. <laughs> Whatever. You know? The sad part is like what if what if this happened, guys? Uh, what if there was a Deadpool offer, four units, not for money, and I was 200 units short for it? Like, even after I opened up all my battle chips, right, and I ended up being, like, 200 units short, um, I'd be so upset. Was it, what are the list of possible pulls from that crystal? I don't know. I wasn't even watching it spin, to be honest. Um, I only watched it towards the, like, the end. They've had in the past two monthly quests, haven't they? Have they really, Dicer? That's good to know. How do you get one star Spider Man? Uh, one star Spider Man was my first champion in the game. Um. All right, what now, guys? We got through all of beginner. At least I got some of the units back just for doing beginner. Uh, okay, cool. Champions are refreshed. Let's get back on this grind then. <sighs> well, you have 1.3 million battle chips. That gives you, what, 2,400 units? Something like that. Somewhere in that ballpark, yeah. I'm in such a habit of exiting offers automatically. I don't notice them anymore. Same here. Uh, I only knew about that one because somebody mentioned it on Reddit, and that was it. Better go hustle your hair for them units. I'm gonna have to. Got a million points. Got some catching up to do. Wait, I got catching up to do, or you got catching up to do? What are you at, Mitch? I'm gonna start doing beginner now, so I can have one star Wolverine and Jugs. Yeah, man, I would love to get them, even though, yeah, I would never use them either. I forgot I'm fighting Agent Venom here. I wouldn't even have tried to get that D Gen on him, but. Luckily, it actually stuck. Cable does pretty good damage if you start the fight out with a, with a D-Gen, man. Like, I, I couldn't even use my level 1 special there, and I just killed a rank 5 Venom. Or, I mean, not Venom, uh, Agent Venom. His damage is not nearly as bad as people make it out to be. Um, it's kind of crazy. Just started the weirdest thing, Brian have an afro. Should I do an afro stream, guys, where I'm just wearing an afro, nothing else special about it? I don't even mention it. Anytime someone mentions the afro, I just completely ignore it. Uh, and only the people who are watching this very stream will know what's going on and why, what, why I'm wearing an afro. Sometimes I think about doing stuff like that, just, just to mess with people. I don't even... I don't know. Someone says no immediately. <laughs> Find us a 2 million and my champs just reset. Nice, Mitch. I do have some catching up to do then. Imagine him with like long surfer hair. Agent Venom can't shrug off degeneration? You sure about that, Terrell? I could have sworn I saw it happen already once. You might be right. I might have uh, been mis uh, misremembering or whatever.
many four star you have? I now have 63 four star champions. I still have to level up a few of them though. Well, a lot of them, but some of them are still at rank one. 550 cable and 660 has been fantastic war boss for us. He had 14 kills last war. Nice. Um, the first day that we put, uh, it, like, somebody used their cable as the alliance war boss, because I can't use mine, but somebody put their cable as an alliance war boss and got 23 kills, and they didn't even kill cable. Like, they just gave up. Because they, they knew they lost, right? If they just kept going at it, he was only at, like, half-life. What are they going to do? Die another 20 times and then give us so many points from dying? Um, so, yeah, Cable Cable can do some damage, guys. Um, I'm not saying you can't beat him. Um, but he's not bad. He's not bad. It's crazy. Like, I don't... I, I still... It still baffles me how that all got started, even. Uh, that Cable was a bad champion. I just like like playing with cable. I can instantly tell like okay, this champion's good. You know, like I didn't I don't know. It's it's strange. Agent man can shrug off DGen. Aha, okay. I thought that was the case. Hey Brian, how much longer on the stream? I got to walk my dog and get something to eat uh, or get something to eat, but uh don't want to miss the rest of the stream. Uh what time is it? It's about around 1:15. Um, I don't know how much longer I'll go, honestly. I really don't. Should I... Hmm. I'll probably do one more round of this on stream. Or maybe I should end it after this round. I don't know. I could, um, I could... I, there is like a video that I want to work on that's 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 coming out for tomorrow. Uh, I'm actually I actually could not finish the uh, the infinite streak video. I stayed up pretty late working on it, uh, but I didn't finish it in time, and now I can't do it because there's no four star arena going on. Um, I can't finish it at least, so I have to make a whole different video for tomorrow. So between between rounds, I might just do that. So I might I might end it pretty soon here actually. After this round, I might end it. We'll, we'll see how I feel. That's because people heard Seaton have uh, a low base crit rate, uh, but it takes take account of his base attack or synergies, which increase that crit rate. Um, I mean, that I'm sure that, that helped keep the... Uh, helped keep it keep it going that uh you know he's not a bad or that he's not a good champion or whatever but um i think it started before that even i don't know i guess people i guess what it is too like somebody said it last time i, I talked about cable is that people like if, if it's not a god tier champion then people just think he's a bad champion um I mean, you see Dr. Voodoo, you see people uh, like Dave using Dr. Voodoo and doing some crazy stuff with that champion, too. Um, I don't know if I would consider that a god-tier champion. He, he does. Uh, but I definitely see that it's a powerful champion, and people underestimated that champion, too. I think it's, I think it's a problem of people just, like, drawing conclusions way too fast. I don't know. Gonna sleep now? All right, have a good one, Zach. <laughs> Tell me more stories involving shark board games. I'll try to save them. Read the last message, Dachi. All right, hang on, hang on. Brian, just do a legendary stream that has been uh, foretold by the Elder Mystics. You in a new hoodie with an afro opening quest crystals one by one. No words spoken, no facial expression, just silence. <laughs> that would be amazing, actually, if I put all of that together. You consider Voodoo God tier, Frojo? I... I, I the only reason that I can't consider him god tier is that I don't have him, to be honest. Um, I have to play around with him. Um, there's certain champions that I don't have to play with, and I could just instantly see that they're god tier. Uh, for ones that are a little bit more complicated, that have a little bit more to them, um, I have to play with them myself. Um, but like Thor, 
I yeah, I mean you, you watch one video and you know, you, you see hits for over a hundred thousand and it's like, okay, that's that. Um, I have to I have to actually play around with voodoo. So I don't wanna say um, that he's good or bad. Or, or, or God tier, not God tier, I should say, right? Because I know he's good. I already know he's good. Right, if I send you an afro... If I send you an afro to your P.O. box, would you wear it on stream? Nah, I... I don't know if I'll ever wear an afro. I mean, if, I, if I'm going to wear an afro, then I'm going to get, like, the nicest afro that uh, the money can buy, guys. And I'm going <laughs> to... I'm going to get, like, this awesome afro. Maybe, maybe I will wear it, because then I could have, like, a Halloween costume if I get other stuff. Maybe I'll actually get an afro, guys. Should I waste money and get an afro? <laughs> what does a good afro even go for? I don't know. Maybe maybe one day. Not not anytime soon, though. Maybe around Halloween. We'll, we'll see. Somebody will have to remind me. You don't have me the Frojo? You gonna go for him as 5-star? I mean, his prestige is sick as a five star too, so that would be a good, good five star to go for. Oh, it's actually not that far away. His five star, right? It's not that far away at all. That's gonna be pretty soon, man. How many shards do you have, Frojo? And how many do you think you'll have by the time uh, his, his crystal comes out again? You can do AQ with them, defense uh, or offense or defense in war. Gray's a quest champ. Actually, that's true. He is, he is a beast of an all-around champion, so he might be there. I really like Ghost Rider. What are your thoughts on him? Uh, Ghost Rider, I haven't really played with much at all, so I don't really have any thoughts on him. Uh, other than he looks really cool. Uh, <laughs> that's my only thoughts. Oh, was somebody asking about God Tier Champs, Kevin was saying here, Thor, Scarlet Witch, Black Widow, Doctor Strange, Star-Lord, uh, and some people say Cap World War II might be, forgetting a couple. Um, yeah, so there's like the main five that everyone just like widely considers to be uh, God Tier, almost 30k, nice Frodo. You think you get 45? Good luck, man, I hope you get them. Um, but yeah, there's like the main five God tier champions that are Thor, Scarlet Witch, Black Widow, Doctor Strange, and uh, Star Lord, and those are like the classic five, right? Um, and then after that, it kind of depends on your own personal preference. So maybe those, maybe those are like the only like true God tier ones. I don't know, but yeah, I, some people put Captain America World War II in there. I personally don't. I think he's good and everything. I just don't put him with the rest of the group. Um, I, I kind of, I don't know, I go back and forth sometimes. I kind of throw in the, um, the immunity champs, like the double immunity champs up there, but maybe I'm wrong for that. Uh, I just, I just, all I know is I love, uh, Ultron. I think Ultron is amazing. Ultron and also Vision. Um, the things that, that Vision can do, like draining your power completely on a level two is insane. Along with, uh, you know, the double immunity, like, I don't know, it's just so good. Um, yeah, some say Wolverine too, yeah, that's, that's another common one that people throw in there. Um, but yeah, it, it, it gets really subjective after, like, the main five. Captain World, Captain World War Two isn't as clutch as OG Cap, that is true. He's not Captain Clutch. He's just like a wannabe Captain Clutch. Agreed on vision, heal block, and insane power drain. Yeah, exactly. Heal block too. How did I forget that? Um, so to have all that utility built into one champion, like there, there are certain there are certain champions that can be considered god tier, like because they're just good in every area of the game. And then there's certain areas, there are certain champions that are just so 
good at like one thing that can be used in a lot of different areas that they can be considered god tier. Because if you look at any of the champions, they all have their weaknesses, except for like, I don't know, maybe like Doctor Strange. Like Doctor Strange is just, in my opinion, Doctor Strange is like, um, I was going to say best all around, but can I really say that with, uh, with Scarlet Witch in there? Um, yeah, I guess Scarlet Witch really doesn't have her downsides other than Labyrinth either. But uh, if you look like the damage dealers, so like Thor and um, Thor and Star Lord, they they have their downsides, right? If for like uh, what's that note? Safeguard node, right? Uh, and then Black Widow, Black Widow's she's not super amazing if the enemy doesn't have defensive abilities that you're looking to get around. Um, Spider Gwen is so good at flipping; she's amazing. Doctor Strange has a reliable heal, unlike Scarlet Witch. I consider them both to be pretty reliable, but yeah. Doctor Strange is terrible against Ultron. Uh, he's not even that bad. Like, his damage is, is pretty crappy if Ultron is awakened, but even still, um, you, can get, you can get rid of his healing. So yeah. Brian, can Ultron uh, cauterize your opponent's bleed from healing from suicides? Did I even say that right? Um, yes, yes, they, uh, Ultron can do that. Same thing with the other Ultron uh, for poison instead of bleed. Scarlet Witch is terrible without a crit team. Yeah, but everybody uses a crit team. And even then, she's not terrible. She's just not um, ridiculous. Uh, she's still really powerful without a crit team. When you're using her in arena, you can still use, you can still see her power very clearly without any crit synergies at all. Honestly, the, the, the crit synergies might be too strong in this game. Um, I don't know. I don't think they should be changed. I don't think they should be nerfed. But I wonder sometimes if Kabam regrets making the, the crit percentages so high. Like, I wonder sometimes if they would have just preferred to keep them like 3 to 4% crit instead of like 5 to 7%. It goes up to 7%, right? How much damage do they take from Cauterize, if any? If any? Um, I don't know. I think it, what is it, like, buff your damage by, like, 50% or, or something like that? I can't remember exactly. I think you're on track to make your end of February goal. Are you talking about subscribers? Uh, subscriber goal, yeah. But that goal is, is not, doesn't really exist anymore. That goal was just because uh, I was I was going to go out to California. And then that all fell through. So I probably should have some other kind of subscriber goal, right? But I don't know. I just, I, I just don't, I guess. Um... I don't know. Dr. Voodoo going to be in the arena again? Uh, he will be as a basic champion. Um, and maybe at some point, like far down the road, he'll be as a feature champion. But um, no time soon. No time that we can predict. Uh, but as a basic champion, he, he'll be around, I think, in May. If I'm not mistaken. Something like that. It was 10k. It was your goal, right? Uh, well, end of February, I wanted to have 15,000 subscribers. Um, 10K was my uh, my Christmas goal. The subscriber number has, has been going up pretty good. Pretty happy with it. You guys must be uh, sharing my videos and stuff. So I appreciate that.
How many conflict crystals to get four star hood? Uh, oh, you're asking how many did I buy? I didn't buy any. Um, if you're asking how many that you would need to buy if you wanted to try for hood, you could buy a thousand of them and not get them. You probably wouldn't need to buy a thousand, but y you could buy a lot of them and not get them. Someone was saying they spent, I think it was like 30,000 units. I think that was the number they spent. After you get 100,000 subs, will you consider making YouTube your full-time job? Uh, I mean, yeah, but 100,000 subscribers is like, is that actually going to happen? I, yeah, I don't, I don't know. I can't see it happening. Um, even like the, 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 even like Seton. Seton's only at, what is Seton at? Did he make it to 40,000 yet? He, I know he was in like the mid to late 30s. Um... I'm sure, I'm sure Cena will get there eventually, because he plays like other games and stuff too, but, um, yeah, I'm just, I'm just playing this game, so I don't, I don't know, I don't know if there's that many people that would actually, like, that are playing this game that want to see my videos, I can see it getting up there relatively high, but 100,000, eh, I don't know, 39,870 is Cena subs count, dude, nice, he's almost at 40,000? That's really good. How do you feel about Jane coming back around as the basic? Takes your entire arena grind full circle back from the start? It does, actually, yeah. Um, that's true. I never even thought about that, Swaggy Spoder. Uh, it would be cool to do like a follow-up on that and just see how much easier it is to get to um, the same amount of points. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll make a video on that, even though I'm not going for her. That's actually not a bad idea, just to show like how extremely difficult it is early on, but if you keep at it, uh, it's really not hard for me to get that, that score anymore. I could literally do four runs of my entire roster, and I would have a higher score uh, than what I scored to get Jane Foster, or it would be about the same score. That would be the entire active player base? Yeah, exactly. I mean, no, that's that's actually not not exactly true, Frodo. There's there's more than one hundred thousand people playing. Uh, it's like roughly a hundred thousand that play that participate in arena, uh, but there are people that don't participate in that arena that that do watch videos and play the game and everything. You sound exhausted in the vid saying you got her. I was exhausted, man. I was so exhausted. Like, uh, that was insane when I got her. I, I still regret. I knew I knew I was gonna regret it, but I still regret not getting um, Rocket Raccoon shortly after that. Because he'd be duplicated right now, and I'd be playing a lot of Rocket. Oh well, I'll duplicate him eventually. They said there's like 47 million players. There's more than that. I think there's like over 80 million that have like downloaded the game. Um, I don't know how many actually log in on a on a daily or, or weekly basis or something like that though. I'm sure there are millions that are dormant or dead. Dude, why'd you have to say they're dead, though, man? <laughs> I'd be messed up if there was just, like, millions of, of players that are no longer living since starting to play this game. Brian, just got my first full-fledged hater. He's made three different accounts just to come here and hate on me. And uh, the funny thing is he's wasting his time because... Hate only fuels the Guardian's power supply. Dude, how have I not been noticing this, man? Are you just, like, banning him so quickly that I'm not even noticing?
Downloads doesn't equal players at all. I've downloaded a few dozen times. Device changes and reinstalls. That's true. I wonder how it calculates that, though. I wonder if, like, you're logged into the store. Does that count as, as another download? Like, if you're logged into your, uh, your Google account or something like that, right, and you hit up the Google store, and you download it a few times on a different device, I wonder if that counts as one download or however many times you actually downloaded it. Guys, maybe that's why they, why, like, if there's an issue and you go to the forums and they tell you what to do, they're like, hmm, try uninstalling the game and re-downloading it. I wonder if that, like, increases the numbers. <laughs> like, I know that's not actually what's going on, but it, it, it's, it'd be funny. I shouldn't have said that, though, because now there's somebody that's going to take that seriously and, like, complain on the forums, uh, just because people are angry. Brian, check Twitter. All right, after this round, I'll, I'll check Twitter. So many new players make accounts till they pull four stars. That's true. I've seen uh, I've seen that advice given out before. So yeah, I know some people do it. <laughs> Back going to the forums. Yeah. I'm kind of bummed, guys. Like, there are times that I want to post on the forums, and I literally can't because I know I, it's just gonna create uh, a crap storm. Like, I, <laughs> it's it's not gonna be like it's it's just better off me not posting. Um, cause there was a there was a um, there was a forum that that someone started uh, saying like or asking what who like which character had the best animations, right? Um, and of course, you guys know that my favorite champion in terms of animations is Howard the Duck. Like, it's not even close. Howard the Duck, by far, is the best animation. So I'm going through this this thread, right? And no one's saying Howard the Duck. And I'm like, what? How could nobody be saying Howard the Duck? Howard the Duck's animations are amazing. Um, and I'm like, I, like, I hit the, you know, reply button, and I'm starting to type out, like, Howard the Duck, you know, his animations, this and that, this and that. And I knew if I hit, like, submit message or whatever, instantly somebody would be like, oh, that's Kuz Kabam gave you Howard the Duck, and... You're stupid because you got it or something like that. I don't know. Um, I was like, ah, oh, man, yeah, I better just leave this thread alone. It's like actually a positive thread on the forums for once. Let me not ruin it here. Um, it like bumped me out a little bit, though. <laughs> Make a different forum name. I actually have another account uh, on the Kabam, for the Kabam forums that I was using for Realm of the Mad God a little bit. So not sure you caught it earlier because I was on the phone. I got Iron Man. Don't let the kid pop premium. Little Brat got me four star Loki. Uh, I I saw that you got four star Loki. I didn't see that uh, that your kid did it again, man. <laughs> That's one lucky kid. The real question is this: Are you are you upset that you didn't do it the other way around? Are you upset that you didn't get Loki and then instantly get him to signature twenty, or do you not care and just? happy to use them just because you can use them as arena fodder and you probably weren't going to use them anyway just use grind brand for anonymity yeah I don't know what Square's going for uh, I'm going for like 2.6 million um, I'm going for 2.6 million uh, the cutoff is usually around like 2.1 to 2.3 ish, somewhere in that area. He's at about 5 4 stars and about 15 tries now. It's all good, maxed Iron Man and got Loki for Arena, so man. Yeah. I got that four-star Hulkbuster to rank three. They got me nice. What were last arenas cutoffs? Uh, I'm not sure. Oh, you're talking about for Loki and Iron Man. Apparently, Loki was like 4.86 million, something like that. Somebody said, uh, and Iron Man was like 7.1 or 7.2. A little bit under what I was predicting. I wasn't too far off though. But yeah, those cutoffs, guys, they're really impossible to predict. 
I uh, can't stress it enough. Every time somebody asks me for a, a cutoff prediction, it's literally just a guess. Um, just an educated guess. Brian, since I started watching your vids, I started tracking crystals, rankings uh, of all my champs and everything. Uh, makes this way more interesting, right? It does make it more interesting, Mitch. That's cool, man. That's cool that you started doing that. Yeah, 7.2, I think. You got uh, 375, 7.4. I have so many spreadsheets. <laughs> yeah, welcome to the spreadsheet club, man. My battery's about to die. Wish you the best. All right, have a good one. Get to that charger. The look on his level three creeps you out. I never noticed it. I never noticed his level three. Like I've, I've used it before, but I've never like like paid attention to it really. You know, what, you know what I like about Loki um, and his animations? I actually like his level 2 a lot. I feel like... Is he the only champion in this game that has, like, ice for an ability? Is there someone else? Like, I don't know. I like when games have, like, all the different elements and stuff like that. Uh, and ice is something that I... I don't think I've seen other than Loki. Maybe I'm forgetting a champion. Alright, Spencer. Have a good one. What's the cutoff for 1,000 shards? 1,000? I don't even have the slightest guess. Not sure. Yeah, just him? Yeah, that's what I thought. Um, when I saw that, I was like, whoa, that's, that's pretty cool. I didn't even expect Loki to have uh, a nice ability. Um, but then again, yeah, I also didn't know anything about the lore behind Loki, and apparently... It's completely normal for him to have an ice ability. You think what you you think one thousand uh, was one, was four point one last you checked? That's not bad actually. I might start going for uh, one thousand shards on Sundays. Loki's from the Ice Giants. Yeah, see, I didn't know that until uh, kind of just recently. It doesn't even look like he's playing. You're talking about me. Uh, I mean, yeah, it's just Arena, so I am, like, kind of barely playing. The elements don't always seem to be well implemented, though. I think for this game, they're, they're, they're pretty well done. You could argue... Well, yeah, okay, so yeah, exactly what you said, I was, I was just about to say. For example, why is Electro damaged by another uh, Electro or Storm? Um, I, I get that argument. It... it it probably does look a little funny, right? Um, but I think it would, like... I think it would bring down the game experience if it didn't work that way. Um, I think it would just be more annoying than anything if you're using Storm and you're going up against Electro and you're not doing damage with your special. I don't think... Like, I think it's worth the sacrifice of maybe not making so much sense, um, like, lore-wise or whatever. Um, and just and just doing the damage, you know. Appearing has to win some kind of award for the all-time corniest champ in the game. I actually like him though. Uh, yeah, he is he is a little bit on the corny side, but uh, I like how he just stands there with his arms crossed to uh, block uh, and his heavy attack. Yeah, dodgy, dodgy, man. <laughs> and Ghost Rider should be immune to incinerate. See, now that one, they I feel like they should have done, just because there's no champion immune to incinerate. So, maybe they should have done that one. I don't know. That one, I'm kind of on the fence about. But the electric ones, I, I prefer the way they have it in game right now. I want to know why Quake can put Concussion on Rocket if he's not touching the ground. That's true. 
three more runs of master yeah I guess you're uh, feeling the same way I am about these quests huh but it's cool that daredevil isn't bothered by invisibility yeah see I, I do like that about the invisibility I, I it's weird like sometimes I like the uh, the unique things that they add to the game the little little flavor things but some of, some of them I don't so yeah They should at least make Electro more energy resistant. Maybe. That one maybe I could see. That actually wouldn't... Yeah, that, that would be fine to me if they made him more energy resistant. As long as you could still do damage and it didn't, he wasn't just like immune to it. Or like healed him or something like that. Um... It's weird, like it's it's a it's a really fine balance when it comes to stuff like that, because like it it could be cool or it could just be annoying. So as long as they keep it like fairly limited, uh, it could be cool, I think. Brian, after how many fights do you keep an infinite streak? Uh, it depends on the arena. Uh, in this arena, I think it's... In this arena, I think it might be like 21. I think in the 4-star arena, it's 19. And the 3-star arena, I think it's 15. I have to double-check that. I think that's what it was. I'm close to my third uh, four-star crystal this month, and the 1,000 shards at the end might push me to a fourth, so my bad streak uh, is over, and I get something good in these next two. Yeah, man, hopefully hopefully you get some kind of god-tier champion in these next, next couple crystals, or at least a really good champion. Who would you say you want the most, Dachi Dachi? Who's, like, the absolute best champion that, that you'd prefer to pull out of those crystals? And thank you, Braxton. Uh, I don't want to read that out loud, though, to, to spoil it for, for Dachi Dachi, even though he knows what I got. <laughs> he knows that one, at least. <laughs> Kamala Khan. Yeah, that's what Dachi Dachi wants most, Kamala Khan, again. Brian, which champ do you want in... in uh Wait, wait, wait. Uh, Hunt in the next arena, Loki or Iron Man? Uh, I'm going to go for Iron Man. I'm either going to go for Iron Man or just Milestones. Uh, I'm going to try to start out strong. If I don't start out strong and it's kind of a weak run for me, then I'll just I'll stop early and um, just go for Milestones. But other than that, I, I would like to get Iron Man. Do Black Panther in the last one? Not bad. Kamala round three. Oh, you already watched it now? Okay, okay. So I watched your opening. I didn't really have time today. I could just spoil it for you if you wanted. <laughs> But in all seriousness, I want either Rocket or Starler dupe, maybe Magic or Double Thor. Yeah, um, all of those would be pretty cool. I want to duplicate my Magic. I would not mind duplicating my Magic. Wow, I thought I was going to hit by those. I felt like I dodged back a little too early. Hope Dimensional Rifts treat me better than I've been treated. Hope I get an Awakening Gem or something good. Yeah, oh man, I'm, I'm wanting a, I want a Science Awakening Gem so bad. Um, I really want a Science Awakening Gem. Do you prefer Reddit or forums? Um, the Reddit or the official Kabam forums? I... Okay, so for the most part, I prefer Reddit. 
there's a there's a large amount of toxicity in, in both areas but for the most part there's less on reddit uh, the official forums are like a toxic wasteland I hate to say it um, I tried to I tried to help out and like bring some uh, positivity to it but yeah it's it's so hard man um, just so many people complain about the dumbest things ever there I don't know it's it's insane um, I do prefer the official forums for Alliance recruiting though. Brian, what is the Science Awakening gem for? Alright, I guess I'll just say it. Uh, Quake. I got Quake today in my, uh, my opening. Um, so yeah, I really want to awaken Quake here. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I guess my roster's done here. Speaking of quick, is it done? Oh, yep. This is the next available champion. Okay. All right. That was that. Wow, it's so much faster <laughs> than doing the four-star arena. It was over before I knew it. Um, but yeah. So here's the thing, guys. If I can awaken quick. Um. I mostly want Quake Awaken for Prestige. Like, let me see how many signature stones I have available for. Spam form is a, is a painful pit of unwarranted eight. Yeah, exactly. And the other thing is too, like, I, I really like the, the, the people at Kabam. Uh, so it'd be cool to, like, talk with, uh, like, Kabam Mike more. I, I think Adora pretty much... She hasn't used the forums as much. She's busy, like, doing other things. But she still... I know she still posts sometimes over there. It'd be cool to talk to those people a little bit more. But it's just so hard to, man. Every time I post something... Uh, oh, man. Like, the hate. <laughs> the hate is insane over there. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, though. About Quake. Um, I want her mostly for prestige. I have 76 of these Awakening Gems here. Um, I do have like a hundred more four star signature crystals, so I can get very close to 99. I don't think it'd be enough to get 99, but it'd be pretty close. And over time, uh, it wouldn't take me that much longer to get to 99. Um, if I did that and then I got Dormammu twice, I could definitely take Dormammu to 99. I already have 69 here. I just need 10 more uh, on top of the 20 signature levels you get from, from uh, duping in, in Arena. Um, so Jamama would be 99, and if both of those champions have high prestige, it would actually put my prestige over 4,300, and that is a lot of prestige for someone in my position. Um, I don't know what that would do for my alliance. I don't know if it would make. I don't know if it, it would, if it would mean my alliance would get tier four class catalyst. Uh, a few other people also have to improve their prestige and stuff like that, but it'd be like a Maybe like a 550 prestige jump or something like that, uh, which is which is pretty good. And not only that, but I, I would still have um, uh, I would still have Black Widow in my top five, and Black Widow's prestige is on the low end. So if I got another champion, let's say a Cosmic Champion, since I have uh, 87 of those signature stones, if I got a Cosmic Champion, a high prestige Cosmic one, uh, my prestige could very easily go like above 4400 in a relatively short amount of time. Although I don't think there's a Cosmic Champion coming up soon in the arena, because next month it's already been leaked that it's like more Mutant Champions or something like that. Um, I'm not sure what I want to do right now, guys. Man, it's Suicides, you're so much faster. Yeah, Suicides are incredible. Brian, you have 97 Cosmic Six Stones. You're right. I do have those uh, those extra 10 there. I forgot about that. Um, so yeah, I could. <laughs> I'm literally one signature stone away from just using one of these uh, one of these Awakening Gems here. Where are those at? Yeah, there they are. Uh, using one of these, the four star Awakening Gem, uh, and just taking a champion to 99. I just need one more. Twitter, Dicer. Yes. My bad. Let me let me check out Twitter. When are you going to open your premiums? Well, March 1st, I'm going to do a premium opening. It's going to be a little different than usual. I'm going to do it on a live stream. Uh, we're just going to start spinning them one by one. Um, 
Twitter, Twitter, here we go. Oh, let me let me uh, get the word out for Dave here a little bit too. Um, Dave's gonna do his corn on the copia live stream tomorrow at 10 a.m. Uh, and Dave is Eastern like me, so 10 a.m. Eastern time. I'm, I'm I think that's what he means. Um, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna be around for that, but you guys might be. Right? How did you get so many awakening gems? Um, I got them. From the specialty stuff, uh, the mystic one was from Greater Gifting Crystals, the generic one is from Act 4, and the two mutant ones and two cosmic ones, they're from, um, like, Chloe's Round 2, Ming Na's, Road to Labyrinth, and something else. I can't remember what the other one was. Oh, I think the other one, I think, was from, oh, wow, I think my first cosmic one, now that I'm thinking back to it. I think it was during the Civil War. Uh, you needed like 10,000 of a certain shard type during the, the Civil War event. And I think that's what I got from that. Pretty sure that's what I that's where I got the Cosmic one. Um, okay. Aha, you linked me the infographic. Let's check this out. I want them to release more stuff like this. Like, seeing these stats, I, I wish they had more. They should really have more of these stats. Uh, okay. How does it ever happen, Dachi Dachi? How does how do crushes ever happen? How do they work? It's a mystery. Uh, Marvel Concentrations is being played on over 87 million devices. Yeah, that is a lot. Um, most used champions by star rating. Cyclops, Doctor Strange, Colossus, Wolverine, Spider-Man Classic. Yeah, I wonder why Spider-Man Classic is, uh is the number one here, right? That's um, like the champion that most people start the game out with, right? Oh, wait, no. no oh, now I see. Now I get it. So one star. Uh, I'm an idiot, guys. Uh, so the most used one star is Spider-Man, yeah. But then at first I thought they were saying like Spider-Man's just the most used, period. I'm an idiot. Okay. Um, total number of fights. Yeah, I knew Rocket was on here. Um... 1.45 billion at least I want to say at least 109 million of these Rocket Raccoon fights were mine I could be slightly overestimating it is Road to Labyrinth achievable without using Scarlet Witch absolutely um, I didn't use Scarlet Witch I did spend a lot of units but if I took my time with it and I didn't stream it I, I'm sure I could have gone through there uh, with minimal units if any at all pretty crazy though let me see if there's anything else that people sent over on twitter real quick i think that was it yeah that was it all right what to do guys what to do do i call the stream here do i stream on Surprised you're not already in a tier 4 class catalyst alliance with your prestige and roster. Uh, looking for an alliance or you're loyal to your crew. Uh, I'm loyal to my crew because I know we're going to get there because we we do really well in the events. Uh, it's just a matter of time. We When I first joined this alliance back in like... Oh man, when did I join this alliance? Like September or October or something like that. Uh, we were still doing like map 3. Um, but we were super... like It was a super active alliance back then. That's the reason why I joined it. It was like a mixture of map 5 and map 3. It wasn't all map 3. And we've just been working our way up. Um, my prestige is not that high, though. My prestige will be like 4,300 plus, but right now it's like 37... 3750 or something like that. Maybe just under that, even. So yeah, my, my prestige is pretty low, actually. Right, I haven't drawn much. Any ideas? Um, any ideas...
draw yourself smashing your crush with a with a shovel <laughs> to help you get get over it. I don't know. I don't know. Show us your champ roster. Uh, I could. I don't know if there's a whole lot to see here. I only have three rank five champions. It's just Cable, Black Widow, and Ultron. Um, yeah, I don't know if there's a whole ton to see here, to be honest. <laughs> Draw your crush eating ham off a shovel. <laughs> That's only gonna make that's only gonna make Dachi Dachi fall in love even more, man. You should rank a five star to rank four. I don't have any five stars that I would take to rank four right now without without awakening them. Actually, let me let me flip this over to five stars. We'll take a look at that for a minute here. Let's talk about five stars for a minute, guys. Um, so none of them are awakened except for Juggernaut, and I'm not a fan of Juggernaut. I actually hate Juggernaut quite a bit. This is like a worst case scenario for me duplicating juggernaut maybe not worst case scenario worst case scenario probably be uh duplicating winter soldier there uh but juggernaut is definitely really far down my list of champions to uh get and duplicate i guess like having one copy of it's not that bad because he's got some useful synergies and stuff like that but i don't even use i don't even use juggernaut in um uh, in alliance war on defense uh i feel like juggernaut is only good in alliance war on defense if you have mystic dispersion and I don't run with Mystic Dispersion, so... Yeah. Any actual di ideas that uh, would make me lose my mind? Uh, they're saying draw Rabid Rocket for Brian to send to Kabam as concept art. If you could do something like that, I... Uh, I was actually thinking about asking... Uh, asking Drew, the, the guy who did my poster back there, to uh, maybe come up with a Rabid Rocket <laughs> for a video for, like, one of my... Um, want to be developer videos all right anyway back to the five star champions none of these champions i would actually take to rank three on awakened i i would i would rank up storm i would also rank up star lord of course um and possibly magneto i don't think i would do magneto right away but if there was a if there was a quest where i felt like i needed magneto's signature ability if i awakened him then i would um so yeah, you know what I should do, guys? Maybe I should just do this. Should I open? I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. There's no way I'm gonna do it right now, guys. <laughs> I should have never even come here. I'm sorry. <laughs> Jugs can still be taken pretty easy with uh, World War II cap, even with Max mixed dispersion. Yeah, he's he's really not that hard for me, and I don't even use cap. And I, I w it would be easier if I use cap than like Hulk. So yeah, I feel like Juggernaut. He's not he's not terribly difficult. I just kabammed us. All right, guys. You know what? I'm sorry for that. I did. You know, I shouldn't have done that. I shouldn't have done that, guys. I shouldn't have. Shouldn't have teased it like that. We'll spin ten of these tonight. We'll spin ten of these tonight. Actually, all right. Here's what I'm gonna do. I am gonna call the stream because I do want to work on the video because I do need to get decent sleep leading up to the Dormammu stream, or, or not stream, the Dormammu arena. Um, now back out double troll. Yeah, so actually I'm not going to open these right now. <laughs> no, yeah, I, I'm going to open these, alright? So here's what I'm going to do though. I'm going to open up my usual crystals and then we're going to end on the premium heroes that I just picked up. Those those 10 premium hero crystals, alright? And then I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to end it after that. Oh, I can't even buy an alliance crystal. I hate... This is stupid. Ending streams early is stupid. Now I can't even buy one of these crystals. Dumb. 
All right, well, let me let me get these arena crystals at least. Twenty premiums for an early end. No, 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 ten is enough, guys. Ten is enough. Settle down. It's been a while since I got a four star out of a premium. Um, I had to open up a bunch for like leveling up units. Oh, come on! I thought that was units. Um, I had to open up a bunch for um, what? Did I I opened it up for cable level up, right? Yeah, cable level up. Uh, and then I opened up a few, like, well, uh, at the end of streams and stuff like that. Open up premiums to your Lion's Crystal resets. I would drain all of my premiums. Better not to open yet. Brian, help me. Did you say something else before that? Let me see. Uh... No, I don't think you did. Help you with what? Five premium crystals for early end? Well, we're going to do ten. We're just going to go with ten. No more, no less. Brian, remember that stream? You needed ISO and you opened like 25... Yeah, I... I and I didn't get any uh, four stars from that. <laughs> Brian, is Dormammu tomorrow? No. Dormammu is um, Thursday. Got a few days. You're gonna get teased with a four-star Punisher for teasing us. See, I'm not even paying attention because I don't even want that to happen. Uh, now I can't help but look. All right, what am I gonna get here? Come on, no units. Brian, is it better to replace uh, Daredevil with Ultron for Alliance Quest? I really like Ultron in Alliance Quest. I'm a huge fan of Ultron in Alliance Quest. Um, I think so, yeah. It, it sort of depends on what Alliance Quest you're doing, what map you're doing. But... For maps one through five, yeah, I would I would much rather use Ultron. No, no units. What is this garbage? Dicer man, where's the units at? You have a second chance if I get a four star champion out of these premium hero crystals, but other than that, it's a doghouse, man. It's a doghouse. I don't make the rules. I, I mean, I guess I do kind of make the rules, but <laughs> them's are the rules. It would be, guys, it would be absolutely insane if I duplicated Quake right now. Can we make that happen? Please, please, kabam. Two-star Hawkeye. Hawkeye, that is not Quake. Pops your loyalty, hopefully map five crystals will give you the two for catalyst necessary to bring your prestige to up to 4200 plus. Yeah, I, I actually have enough catalyst right now to get to over 4200, so... Um, I'm fine in terms of catalyst, I just need the right champions. Just waiting on the champions, pretty much. Which is one of the reasons why I've been grinding feature champions like crazy lately. Uh, although, to be honest, I don't know if I'll ever stop doing that. Um, a little bit addicted to grinding feature champions. <laughs> why Ultron isn't duped doing map 5? Uh, oh. <laughs> uh, that's okay. If your Ultron isn't duped, that's fine. I mean, Daredevil's nice with that like auto evade and stuff like that, but in my opinion... I'd rather Voltron. Try it out. Try. You know what you do? Try it out on an easy day. Try it out on like day one or day two or something like that. Um, and, and just feel it out that way. Why do you think using an Ultron and Vision is overkill in Alliance Quest? Or is that a decent setup? Um, I, To be honest, I don't think Vision is, is that great in Alliance Quest. I don't think he's bad. Uh, I could have a three star at least. 
Um, I don't think vision is that bad, but I yeah I don't know I I, I don't like using my lion's quest really. Uh, I like having champions that can heal. Um, and even though I'm using Ronin that can't heal, um, I'm more using Ronin just as like a backup champion and a class advantage against um, against uh, tech champions. Yeah, like Dicer said, Vision is better in Alliance... Oh, what is this with this guillotine stuff? Uh, Vision is better in Alliance War than Alliance Quest. I completely 100% agree with that. We tried Map 5 for the first time, and it's actually easier than we expected. It's uh, really just about being more coordinated, not necessarily stronger. Yeah, that's that's pretty much it. Um, when it comes to Map 5 versus something like... Even like Map 3, the difficulty of each fight is not drastically it's not drastically more difficult it's just um y like it requires more moves pretty much right <laughs> um so people have to be on more throughout the day people have to pay attention to their energy uh and then also oh, come oh this is stupid i hate spinning premium hero crystals <laughs> thought that was gambit man okay uh, and then also you can get like worn out throughout going through maps like the longer maps it, really what it is is that you can get worn out because you're, you're just doing more fights in general but in terms of difficulty it's it's not it's not anything too crazy right a chance of releasing those spreadsheets you made blank uh, we'd we'll love to use them I mean I don't have like like, I really want to just have them on, like, my website or something like that. So, not anytime soon. Um, I'm going to be, like, reorganizing my entire life here, though, pretty soon. So that I can uh, spend a lot more time on the website. Because that, like, missing out on going to uh, California, where that was supposed to be, like, you know, me, me still going for my dreams of trying to be a game developer and stuff like that. Uh, missing out on that, like, it, like that, that trip to California was like making up for not spending so much time learning, uh, in terms of like making the website and stuff like that. But now that I'm not even going to California, this is kind of like a wake up call. Like, man, I need to put more time towards, uh, learning how to program. And the way I can do that is by making that website awesome. So, uh, yeah, I have to, I, I really need to find like two hours a day. To, to put towards the website. I'd be happy if I could do that. But like literally every single day, two hours a day, except for maybe during like a Dormammu grind or something like that. All right, guys, going to sleep, working tomorrow. I'm pretty sure my boss won't accept, but you got to hear this story about shark attack as an excuse. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> have a good one. Keep the stream alive, Brian. I really do need to work on a video for tomorrow. I have a cool one in mind. It's going to be like a short video, relatively short, but it's a cool concept, and I'm excited. It's a different video than anything that I've, that I've ever put together before. Um, I'm not saying nobody's put together a video like this, but it's, it's different for me, so I'm excited about it. I guess somebody's asking my favorite champion again because I see Dodgy Dodge saying it's one of three, either a homeless guy, duck, uh, or a raccoon. <laughs> Brian, who are some viable uh, champions for Master Mode Dormammu? I haven't even done Master Mode Dormammu yet. I've heard Ronin uh, is is a is a monster there for Dormammu, but I heard there's also like a lot of options for him. I don't even know what he does though, so yeah, I, I'm not the one to go to for that help. Is She-Hulk any good? Pulled her as a four star yesterday. She is okay. She's like a little bit weak in my opinion. She has decent synergies. A unique one. Oh, I would have taken that superior Iron Man too. Um, man, is this all two stars? Um, 
She Hulk's a little bit weak in my opinion. I wish her stun was more reliable, and then I think she'd be fine. Um, yeah, that's my thoughts on her pretty much. Been using Scarlet Witch. Storm Witch, a few kills on him. Yep. The old Scarlet Witch. X23 can easily beat Dormammu. I think, I mean, most champions probably could, right? Like, I don't know. I I got I to gotta actually do it myself. Yeah, this is all two stars. Womp womp. I'm getting really close, though. I think Iron Fist, I think uh, he was up to, what did it say, 98? So, yeah, I'm getting close to maxing out these two stars. Guess you better open 10 more, not even a 3-star. Yeah, nice try. Nice try, Dachi Dachi. Uh, that's going to do it for tonight, guys. Um, I'll be back normal time tomorrow. Uh, I'm going to go work on that video and keep going in the arena because I still have another two rounds to go. I think two rounds to go, right? Let me just double-check that score. Let me see where I'm at. Yeah, 1.5, so yeah, two more rounds should do it, I think. Maybe I'll end up slightly below my goal. But you know what? My, my, my five-star champions are probably almost refreshed. Yeah, all right, so I'll do one more regular round, one more round with the five stars, and then I'll be good. All right, cool. All right, guys, yeah, that's it for tonight. Thanks, as usual, for uh, coming to hang out. And whoops! And hopefully you guys grind is is going well. If you're uh, hitting up the cornucopia or whatever you guys are doing, uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow.